everyone in the land of Oz in Australia. Good evening for those of you in the United States of America. Late night for you in Europe and a very early morning for us here in Bangkok, Thailand. This is Ken Krell. I am thrilled to have you with us. I hear the cough of Dr. Nathwani in the UK. Good morning, Mark. <laughs> Sorry, I should have muted myself. It, it, you pro probably should have. But <laughs> was, but but Mr. That was a frustrating cough. Like. <laughs> well, I know, Rob. It's good, well, good well, good I, 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 I wanted to first of all let's make sure you guys can hear us. Okay, I know that you can see Mark's. Um, uh, we've got a webinar control panel. We're working on figuring how to get rid of, how to hide that. Um, but if you would, I, I, I can I can I can hide it. We won't a minute. Mark, Mike says hello. So where are you guys coming in from? If you just pop in the chat, because it seems that you can probably hear me okay. I want to make sure that we get that sorted out and organized before we begin the festivities here with you all today. So I've got uh, Mike's in from Oklahoma. Excellent. I love Oklahoma. Actually, people in Tulsa are amazing. Tul Tulsa and OKC. And central Pennsylvania, Tom, is coming in from. Great. Where, where are the rest of you coming in from? Talk to me. would love to know so I can we can relate. Um Okay, go thunder, Mike says. I had the coldest seminar I ever taught in my life in, I think it was Oklahoma City. I actually had to give the entire audience blankets uh, for the two days that we were that we were there in the hotel. Charlie's in, Aust in Australia, Steve's in Montana, Bob's in Northern sure. California, Richard's coming in from New Zealand, yay. Gail, I, am, I haven't seen you in ages, where have you been? I know you've been in New Jersey, but like what's been going on, girl? I haven't seen you in a long, long time. Glad you're back. Martin's back, fantastic, from Norway. That's fan that is great, I love it. Late night for you, my friend. Um, I see some of my friends from, from New Jersey, Serena, excellent. Uh, I, see, I see my friend Wendy, my colorful lady Wendy from Trailblazers is here, trying fantastic. Uh, doing real estate, Denmark, Klaus is in, Maria's in Austin, this is great. I am so excited to see you guys, this is tremendous. What a great turnout today. So a few of you are, st are staying hidden, but I know you're here. <laughs> Mark, what, what are you touching back there? It sounds like you're like making coffee in the background. I'm eating olives, actually. You're, 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 you're what? I'm eating olives. You're, oh, you're eating olives. Great. Okay. That's good. I've got a, I, I've got a, I've got a, I've got a, I've got a friend and colleague here from, uh, he's all the way from, uh, you probably don't know the geographical status of the UK, but he's from Watford, which is like an hour and a half north of where I am, northeast of where I am, northwest. northwest and, he, and he brought you olives? And, uh, well, no, I had, I, I, I had some. We were just having a... Okay, uh, Mark, Mark... Half, half, half a glass of wine and some olives. Okay, well, I wouldn't have disclosed the wine to everybody. Thank you very much. No, that's fine. That's uh, fine. So, listen, listen, buddy, it's, it's like it's like midnight here, you know, so i got to find a way of... Yeah, Mike, Mike, I, normally, Mike I know. Normally it's I know. coffee, but half a glass of wine uh, is okay, okay with it, buddy. Okay, <laughs> okay, okay, Mark, so here's the deal. Before we started, you yes. sounded fantastic. Now your, your sound's going in and out, and your sound, your, your volume has gone down the tanker. So let's, let's pump okay, you back up. You guys, let's, let's talk a little bit, Mark. Is that, is that, is that better? It's better for me. How about the rest of you guys? Everybody else, how are we doing? Carol, is he better? You, Ruby, is he better? Ruby says better? Not, not so much. Mike says yes, you're better. You're better for me. Ruby, you might want to pump better, your yeah? you might want to pump your volume below. Gail says good. Okay, excellent. The, the, okay, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do a one to ten and tell me uh, if it <laughs> every, makes any difference or not. Everyone's because, saying you know I've got a I've got a mic on this, but I don't think the mic on my headphone works. It's a mic on my computer, so I'm gonna go one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Did that make any difference? Or was zero, it zero difference. Not a difference Same. in the world. So it's, it's, it's the mic on my computer. That's good. Okay. That's fine. All right. But I, what I would do is I'll leave your headset on though, Mark, because when you had the mic on your computer before, you were yeah, get, you, you, it was getting background. Bad. Yeah. Okay. Bob says you're a ten. All right, ladies and gentlemen, let's get going right, with this party. Start. All right. You ready, so Mark? So shall I start? Let me know. Let me know uh, when you want me to go. I think we. Well, well, I'll introduce you. Then we can start. And so, uh, otherwise, it would be sort of like you know without a thing. So I'm going to uh, I'm going to count down, and we'll do a, a more formal presentation now. Before I do the countdown, my friends, this time is for you. So I encourage you if you've got cell phones running around, I know they're nearby because no one's ever more than about three feet away from their cell phone. Put it in the silent or vibrate position so people don't bother you. Uh, if you've got clutter on your desk. You should probably just throw it away because you're never going to look at it again anyway. <laughs> it only gets in the way of production, and uh, and it's di very distracting for everybody. Uh, it really is. Clutter is just a big. We're gonna have to have a conversation about that in the future. But I want to I want to uh, really have you honor the time that you put you've set aside for today. This is really uh, going to be well worth your time for sure. And uh, I want to make sure you don't miss anything because Mark can go quick, quick sometimes. He gusts it like 180. 
So with that said, let me count down to three and uh, we'll start formally. So here we go. Three, two, one. Well, good morning, everyone. Good afternoon. Good evening for all of you all over the world from Norway, from the UK, from New Zealand, from Australia, from the great <coughs> land of the, of the United States, to my friend in the background who is coughing. I am thrilled to have all of you with us. This is Ken Krell, your master of ceremonies, um, and I'm grateful that you're here. This time is for you, and we're going to do a lot. We have a lot to cover today. Um, my guest, Fernando's coming from Colombia. Fantastic. Uh, I am, and I'm assuming we're not talking about South Carolina either. Um, I got to tell you that the, the the gentleman that we have with us today, and I'm using the word gentleman, well, accurately, actually, uh, he's one of the nicest guys uh, you'll ever meet. And I've worked with a lot of people over the years doing conferences and seminars and webinars and so on. And um, what are you doing back there? <laughs> and he wants to show you this girl that's like, that's that's got her, never mind. Um, Mark is is really cool. And when we were doing our first conference, the only thing Mark could keep saying to me is, how can I help you? How can I help you? How can I be part of the team and help make this successful? That kind of team mentality for me goes a really, really long way. And I say that because what's more important to me than what someone's accomplishments are is who they are and what they've really done and how they contribute. And this is a gentleman who whose actions speak louder than words. And I wanted to share that with you because I think it's really important. You like that Branson picture a lot, don't you? That girl that's like, that you like, either that or I just keep noticing it. Um, you see a picture of Richard Branson on his screen. I just joined Richard Branson's gym here in, in Thailand. So I have this great affinity now for at least being somewhat close to Richard now that I'm a regular customer of his. So anyhow, Richard, Mark, Mark is, is, uh, has been very successful in real estate. He's spoken for us on the real estate platform before. Uh, Mark is to me is one of my content management, one of my content um, uh, marketing geniuses because he's really made, figured out a way to create this gigantic shortcut in, in creating product. And for you, if you're going to want to make a big difference in the marketplace and have influence that's so important these days and really set yourself apart, you need to have your own identity. You need to have your own branding. You need to have your own product. Uh, that brand, what is this with this Branson thing in you? The, the the key though to that, and I'll I'll take the I'll take the lead on that for a second. You saw that picture of Richard Branson and the girl above his head a minute ago, and you'll see it again when when Mark hits his next slide. The thing about it is that when you create your own brand, you can be your own Branson. You can have that element of notoriety, and you can have that personality. The cool thing that's important for you is that so many people that are beginning in, in the online marketing business or any business for that matter, don't have their identity and they're so busy representing other people's stuff that they don't create their own. I find it really important and that's why it was so important to me to have you here today so that we could give you the, the this information and give you the power to be able to have your products starting immediately and really build quickly. So Mark, as we bring you on, I'm gonna ask you to, to, to keep your background um, movements to a minimum because you are making so much noise back there. Um, so if you can just just hit the advanced thing and not much in, and not much, not much else because your computer is picking up everything in the background. Okay, so um, I also want to make sure that we do have a clear a clear recording. Um, yeah. So Mike, if if we do lose you, um, we are we are doing the best to double record this. We don't often do replays anymore because replays have tended to be unproductive. But I want to make sure we had this one in the can, and, we want, and I want to make sure we had this one in well, because this is going to be really good. So, Mark, can you hear me back there? I can, absolutely. First of all, I'm going to uh, say hi to everybody. Um, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever part of the world that you're in. Um, apologies for you keep seeing that screen. There's a reason for that, Ken, and I didn't want to interrupt while you were saying sure. it. Sure, okay. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to get rid of this control panel, which everybody can see. And yeah. By doing that, I was, I was clicking next, and anyway. That's one of those things. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I don't know why you I can't get rid of it. I, I cannot understand why the microphone is so sensitive because normally it's the opposite. Nobody yeah. can hear me. Yeah, yeah. So I'd rather it be more sensitive than not. So uh, yeah. we're ready to go. Okay, so here's the deal. Just move, move it as close to the side as you can and close it up. I'll do the questions for you so that we'll, we'll be good there because um, normally that's the only reason why you need it is for the questions. Yeah. Right. Yeah, you know, you know I, also use the control, I also use the control panel to mute myself sometimes. Well, you're going to be talking. Um, you'll be talking most of the time, so <laughs> hopefully you're not going to mute yourself in the middle of your presentation. I do. No, I do sometimes. You know, when you're asking a question. Ah, okay. Well, don't worry about it. Me, I kind of 
I, yeah, but right now, right now it's, pre it's pretty much okay. Um, it, you know, it's just, it's, it's a, it's not hitting too much of the screen. So, so, uh, so we're good. All right. So why don't we, why don't we get started with this party? And uh, ladies okay. and gentlemen, let's give a warm totalpreneurship welcome to my friend, Professor Mark Nathwani. Woohoo! <laughs> I like, I like, I love, I love the professor bit. Okay. Uh, what, what, once again, good evening, good, good morning, good afternoon, guys, wherever you are. Uh, today is actually going to be a really, really very, very exciting webinar because at the end of tonight's webinar, I've got um, a, a box of surprises. Normally, I have one huge surprise, but this time we've got a few. <clears throat> um, I've got a, a, such an amazing announcement to make. Um, so whatever happens, and you know, these webinars always with, with Ken, they tend to uh, go on a little bit longer. Uh, for two reasons. Firstly, um, Ken says to me, slow down a bit and don't whiz through it. Um, and so I've learned to slow down a little bit. Um, normally I whiz through it because there's just so much content. I try and get it within 60 minutes. But, you know, if I slow down a little bit, it goes a little bit over. And then there's always this absolutely fantastic questions and answers session at the end. And we have a very friendly discussion. We get to know each other um, and all kinds of stuff. It's just like a big firework display at the end. So please, Take your time, stick around, do not disappear, um, be here throughout, otherwise you're really going to miss a lot of stuff. Um, uh, okay, with, uh, without any further ado, I'm going, to, I'm going to carry on. You'll see a picture of some very, very famous celebrities here. They're there for a reason. Um, and again, you know, guys, when, uh, for the first few slides, there's going to be some stuff which, um, you know, it's, it's, it's not to impress you by any means, it's to impress upon you the sort of stuff that can be achieved um, if you put your mind to it. Um, so please do bear that in mind. I, I don't want it to sound in any way, shape, or form at all arrogant. That's that's that's, that's not me at all. Um, but it's just it's just just that while I've been in this business for the last few years, um, you know, I've I've shared stay shared the stage with with people like Richard Branson, Lord Sugar, um, you know, Jared Robbins, Tony Robbins' son, Kevin Harrington. Who's the owner of um, Shark Tank, which is equivalent to Dragon's Den um, here in the UK? Is a, they, they call him the four billion dollar guy because he's done you know, that much sort of um, volume of business um, through through the Dragon's Den. And uh, obviously we've got um, uh, Karen uh, Karen Brady there, and everybody knows Ruby Wax. Um, so th those are the people that. I've been very, very fortunate, very lucky, very excited to share the stage with. Um, it's not something that I realized would happen when I got into this business. When I got into this business, if you'd have said to me that, Mark, you know, over the next course of a couple of years, you're, you're actually going to be um, on, on, on friendly terms with these kind of people, I would have never believed you. But that, that's where it's, it's got me to. Um, okay, now. The, the, the main um, topic of this webinar is going to be how to be successful smartly. And I'll tell you why being successful smartly is, is key, because I've got two very successful people here, Donald Trump and Richard Branson. They've not become successful by working hard. We can all work hard. I can wake up at 6 o'clock in the morning and work till midnight and you know, work 18, 20, 24 hours a day. We can all work hard. These guys haven't become successful um, by necessarily by working hard. They've actually worked smart. So a lot of this webinar is going to be based on how you can be successful by working smart. Now it's very, very important. So do remember that um, throughout the webinar because that's one of the reasons why I've created this library. And this library actually allows you to be successful by being smart. Um, it's always nice to know um, what you're going to be listening to for the last, uh, for the next um, 60 to 75 minutes. And this is a presentation contact, uh, content. There's going to be a little bit of background about myself. Then we're going to introduce the library to you. Um, I'm going to tell you a little bit about what PLR and resale rights are, because obviously this is about the world's largest library um, of uh, uh, e-products that have PLR and resale rights. And, 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 and Mark, let me stop you right now. It's not obvious to them at all. I've not told them that. They have no idea what they're in for. 
So do cool. not do not That's assume that, do not assume they have a clue because they do not. I do, That's I, even better. I, I, you I know, not, my, my, yeah. I do not That's want fine. any the PLR has a really bad connotation. And if I told people mm-hmm. this is what this but we're gonna talk about that a little bit, we would lose a lot of folks because they already judge PLR negatively. But it is the secret weapon behind most content that's out there because it is the grist for the mill. Ooh, I like the way I said that. So um, keep going, but don't assume anything because I haven't I haven't laid no, that absolutely, foundation. Absolutely. Now this this webinar is designed for somebody, uh, you know, in fact, for, ho- hoping that you're open-minded um, and 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 you know don't know much about it. So that that's that's the best thing that can that can happen. Then we're going to go into some business top tips. Um, I'm going to give you some absolutely fantastic secrets, so we're going to unleash some really good secrets. Then I'm going to give you some absolutely phenomenal, fantastic, um, quite exciting income generation strategies. Now, if by this time you guys are still with us, and I hope that you are, because you have to be, and you're wide awake, then I'm going to give you the exact ingredients to online success. And this is really where, you know, on a graph, if you get sort of like people tending to relax a little bit. At number seven, we're going to really wake you all up again. Then, once we've told you, um, you know, what, what the exact ingredients to online success are, we're going we're gonna to show you how to get all those ingredients. And I should have put in the brackets um, kind of a very, very little or no value, but, you know, um, we, we're, gonna, we're not, we're not going to do that. Hint, hint. Um, and obviously, there's going to be a hell of a lot of content so do please stay focused. I'll put that in red. Really do please stay focused. So if you if you now want to spend the next kind of 30 seconds uh, shutting the door, putting the cat out, turning that radio off, um, putting the uh, uh, nipple in the baby's mouth, not literally nipple, but I mean a little dummy nipple in the baby's mouth to, to shut the baby up, do whatever you have to do to make sure that you are absolutely focused and concentrating, then here we go. Right, guys, I have some golden rules, um, and those are always give massive value. Always give outstanding service, have integrity, be different, and respect everyone, whether they're a prospect, whether they're a customer, whether they're you know, just in making an inquiry, it doesn't matter what it is, respect everyone. Now, I'd like you to either write this down or remember it, because it's going to be very, very relevant right at the end. Because I want you to question you on all of these points. And um, you know, when 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 I when I make the offer at the end, um, we're not going to hide the fact that yes, there is going to be an offer at the end. There is. And if it's not, there absolutely is. I'm, I'm not shocked. Not going to webinar where there isn't an offer I, at the end. I'm so shocked. Not gonna, we're not going to hide that fact. We're not going to be shy <laughs> of that fact. There is going to be. So stay focused. Be with us because I'm going to blow your brains out. And if it's not absolutely fantastic value and I haven't given you terrific service and I don't have the integrity, I've not been absolutely different and I haven't respected all of you, then you can log off. So there's the challenge, right? <laughs> so anyway, stay with us, right? So let's start off with uh, webinar content. And the first one, as I said, is a little bit of background information about myself. So I'd like you to get to know me so you know who I am. I've got 30 years experience of business development wealth creation, personal coaching. I've been the CEO of a public listed company. I am currently the charter president of one of the world's largest charity clubs, which has 45,000 clubs and 22 million members worldwide. Mm. And for 26 of the, those years, um, I've been into property. Um, at the age of 16, my first large business deal my first decent business deal was I had sold a thousand pieces of Rubik's Magic to Hamley's Toy Store in, in Regent Street here in London, which is one of the world's largest largest toy stores, or it absolutely was at that time, without a penny investment. I could probably spend an hour just on this slide alone and explain to you exactly how that all happened. It's absolutely totally a true story, not a word of a lie there. Um, maybe that's for another day. Um, at the age of 19, I borrowed $18,000 from the bank, which is equivalent to 12,000 UK pounds. I put my my parents' home on the line, and I opened up a video store, and I called it the Fulham Video Vault. And I called it the Video Vault because we had a basement, 
and I kept all the horror and all the gory stuff downstairs. We had spiders, webs, and you know, it was it was really really kind of cool. There was like a nice little hot section. We called it fully. Hey, hey Mark. Mark. Everyone's I, favorite section. Yes, sir. I, I got to have you pump your volume up a bit. I, either go a little bit louder. Because yeah, yeah, I'm probably moving away. I'm moving away you, from you the mic. Is that better? Yeah, it, yeah. You because yeah, you're going in and out, okay. and I. Okay, stay close. Okay, okay, I'll, 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 I'll remember to stay close to the mic. Um, okay, and that very quickly became the largest video wholesaler um, and retail supplier in the southwest of London within months of launching. Now, you know, the next few slides uh, are going to um, mention the fact that any business that I've been involved in has become successful very, very quickly. And there's a reason to that. So just make a note on the side or, or just make a mental note of that because it's very relevant and very important. And I forced a large competitor a mile away to close down. Um, now, again, this is, this is very relevant as well. And, and I'd like you to listen to this quite carefully. I introduced confectionery and tobacco into the store. And I did that because I regularly saw my customers come in to rent a video and they used to come in with a handful of newspapers, drinks, chocolates, etc., etc., etc. And you know, I'm I'm looking at them. I'm thinking to them, you know, I've got a huge store. There's plenty of space to have this kind of stuff there. And I'm losing. You know, I'm renting out videos for fifty pence and one pound. It was in those days, which is like seventy-five U.S. cents and about a dollar fifty. And I'm missing out. On about five or ten dollars worth of other uh, other shopping, on which there's equally good margin, 25, 30 percent margin, and you know it's very important to know that there's no real difference to offline businesses and offline marketing as there is to online businesses and online marketing. The whole point is that when somebody comes into your store, they they come in onto your website. The principle is the same. We'll come onto that. Um, a, a little bit in more detail in one of the other slides, where um, I've heard this phrase in the USA that we want more uh, bang for your buck, or we want more buck from a customer than actually comes in. So the more eyeballs on your website, the more people that step foot into your store, you want to try and get as much dollar from them as you possibly can. And it's exactly the same online. So I introduced confectionery and tobacco. So instead of them spending now 50 cents and, and, and you know, 75 cents and a dollar 50, I was now, my average sale was now becoming sort of anywhere between five and $10. Now that actually forced four local competitors to close that were selling tobacco and confectionery because I did cut price tobacco and I did that to bring more people in. So those that were not my customers were now my customers because they came in to buy their cigarettes and saw the videos and they bought other stuff. And again, that's very important. We'll, we'll explain in detail how that same principle can be applied online as well. I sold that business four years later for 300,000 US dollars. And if you remember, just at the top of that slide, I borrowed 18,000 from the bank. And four years later, that's a huge multiple. And again, please do remember that I'm not saying some of this stuff to impress you. I'm saying it to impress upon you, okay? Then I went into the car audio business and I became the largest independent car audio retailer and reseller in the UK. And within the first year of trading, I grew to eight stores. So again, there's an example of how I went into a, a completely brand new business, not knowing much about it, and it grew into a very successful business very, very fast. And I beat established and existing businesses in that car audio field. And I operated that business for 13 years. And that there, you can see a picture of my demo van. And again, I can probably spend an hour just on this slide and this business, which was, you know, obviously it was very, very exciting and some great times, but, you know, we will move on. Now, whilst I was in this business, um, I noticed a, a, a gap. I noticed a gap in the market, and the gap in the market was vehicle security. Vehicle security was very, very popular, but people expected a vehicle security to be effectively like a 24 hour security guard standing over your vehicle with a machine gun. So if somebody tried to break into your car, they'd expect that alarm to, to shoot the thief. And you know, in reality, it doesn't do that. All it is, it's a deterrent. It makes a noise, 
hopefully the thief will get frightened and run away. Um, so I saw a gap in the market and I invented a product called Recall. Now Recall was the world's first vehicle security device that allowed you to stop your car from anywhere in the world using your phone, any phone, whether it's a mobile phone or a landline. And that company went from zero to 131 million pounds, 200 million dollars in market cap. And British Aerospace were uh, eventually the shareholders in that company. And at Las Vegas, in, uh, in uh, sorry, the, the Consumer Electric Show in Las Vegas, I won the most innovative product of the year award. And as I sit here presenting to you today from my study, I have that award right in front of me. Um, and those of you who've been on this webinar before will, will have heard that, and I'm still very, very proud of that award. There it is there, I can see there, Innovation 97, um, World Innovative Product of the Year. Now, guys, all that glitters is not gold. And, you know, at this stage, I had some content which I've cut out of my slides because at a, at a live presentation um, on stage when I had some of... Uh, some of my life's sobs stories, I actually got quite emotional, so I've cut them out. But the basic message here is that, look, guys, we're born with nothing. And we're going to die with nothing. But we have a life in the middle of all that. And life is short. And, you know, I, I, I just want to say the message on this slide is um, enjoy, enjoy your life. It's not all about making money. And there is a video at the beginning of this presentation, which I can't play on a webinar, but the message on that video, again, is that we can, we can help you make money, but happiness is a leap up to you. So by the age of 39, I'd made, my, uh, I'd made errors. I'd earned my gray hair. That gave me a lot of experience. I'd made and lost a lot of money. I'd been through my, uh, as I say here, I'd been through my, my, my fair share of life's stresses, problems, mistakes. And this is quite a nice uh, picture here where there's a guy pointing at everybody saying, lost a fund, needs you to volunteer. So, you know, normally when I'm live on stage, when I ask people, does that sound familiar to anybody? And I see lots of heads in the audience nodding and saying, yeah, yeah, yeah. So you know what, folks, um, at the end of the day, uh, you and I uh, are no different. Um, we've all been through our ups and downs and that. But now the important message here is that I remained focused on my life. And here you can see my wife, Sunny, my two boys. They're both lawyers now. And, you know, it's, it's the focus that's, um, that's got me through a lot of challenges. So if you guys are going through any challenges here, again, the message is do please stay focused. Now, apart from focus, most importantly is, guys, and I'll put this in, in red, make a decision you know so many people i come across when i do webinars when i speak on stage when i meet people when i coach people is they struggle to make a decision and you know the day you struggle to make a decision is the day you, you're going to really struggle to move forward in your life so do not be afraid to make a decision be it the right decision or wrong decision make a decision and then you know once you've made that decision don't just sit around and not do anything about it please take action now you'll see when you make a decision you take action you know be it right be it wrong be it good be it bad it will produce results and you know i've always done that i've always made decisions fairly quickly i've taken action it's produced results and at times it's been the wrong decision and the wrong action and it's produced a bad result but you know i've learned from it so you know honestly don't be afraid in this particular case um i've created the world's largest PLR and resale rights library or warehouse. And I'll explain to you in a second just what that is. Now, I'm, I'm going to go back just a little bit and explain to you how this whole library was created. So, you know, in January 2010, I started my internet business. And this was because my main um, business up until that time was real estate. I'm, I'm you know, my, my background is property, property investing, property development. And in 2008, the market crashed I went to uh, Dubai for for a year to see you know what, what the situation is there again Dubai collapsed and I could I could see that this was not a short-term problem you know I was twiddling my thumbs and I could see that I'm, I'm going to be hibernating in the real estate market for for quite a while 
Um, I decided to go into internet, internet marketing, um, starting an internet business. And I started my internet business by spending $750 in 90 minutes. Now, you know, this is very important. I want you to remember this slide and these figures, $750 in 90 minutes, because it's going to be really very relevant a little bit later on. Um, and, you know, I, I did that by, by downloading um, within, within 90 minutes, by downloading lots of PLR, for those of that, you're still wondering what is PLR, they're private label right products, and again, I'll explain to you in a minute what, what that is, and resale rights products. And that was as a result um, of me spending three days attending um, an internet marketing, um, like, a, like, a, like, a, like an internet marketing school, uh, like a course, a three-day course, which I had signed up to by going to one of these events that we're all familiar with. Now, when I downloaded these products, and I downloaded for that kind of money about a thousand products, that's a lot of products. And I could very easily, very quickly see, um, you know, my, my background is, you know, I'd like to say I was half an entrepreneur, I was a businessman. Um, you know, that, that's kind of like my, my expertise, my, my speciality. And it wasn't difficult for me to just sit back and see that these products, number one, are worth a lot more than what I paid. Number two, they allowed, um, they allowed me to resell them and keep all the money. And they were of a huge value. Now, you know, all these three points are quite key for any business or for any business person. So immediately value came to my mind. And by March 2010, I developed already the world's largest library. I had 15,000 products within a few months. Um, and even today, the second largest library from mine, and mine's over a million, is really no more than about five or 10,000 products. So you can see I'm, I'm, I'm way ahead of, uh, of any, any, any competitor. The library is now recognized by leading gurus and individuals globally. And this is what it consists of. It now consists of over a million products, and that comprise of over half a million ebooks that cover over a thousand, uh, I'll say niches, because the USA say niches, we say niches, so we're going to say niches, because I think a lot of the attendees here are going to be from the USA. Uh, we've got thousands of valuable audio and video information products. We've got hundreds of thousands of articles across over 700 niches. We've got graphics, and the graphics consist of JPEGs, fonts, designs, and other types of graphics. We've got tutorials across hundreds of niches. We've got sales pages. We've got templates, we've got images, tones, we've got educational products. We've got a, 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 an incredible source of countless businesses, entire businesses as a sideline. And you know, my products range, I've got a wide range of, uh, a wide price range from zero. Um, and a lot of products are zero or, you know, not any monetary value, but quite a lot of education and informative value. But those I give away to build a list. And again, I'll explain that in a bit more detail as we go along. Up to Mike Filsane's butterfly um, uh, outsource of the butterfly, which he was selling for $19.97. That was a $2,000 product. I bought the resale rights for that. Um, I'm one of only a few, and the whole open source is available on resale rights from my store. And I've got lots and lots of products that are worth way over $1,000. And all of these products are completely free to members. Now, remember, just going back to that slide where I said I had spent $750 just on a thousand products. Can you imagine what more than a million are worth? Yeah. So just just bear that in mind. And you know, guys, um, uh, the, the library is, is an answer to almost any question that you may have to do with you know in, internet marketing or just sales or marketing in general, and it assists. Pretty much, I would say, um, you know, I'd, I'd, I'd say that it's all strategies. You know, I'd be hard, hard, hard pressed to find strategy which my library cannot assist. So let's just talk about who uses these products for a moment. Well, we've got newcomers to internet marketing, and we've got experienced marketers, both use my library. We have people that do not have a product. Obviously, it's brilliant for them because. <laughs> My library is full of content and full of product. 
Now, we've got members, many members, that have tons of product. And the reason they use it is because they, a lot of them are product creators. And there's, there's, there's more reasons why you should use my library, even if you do have a product. And I'll go through those again in detail in a moment. We've got authors, lots and lots of authors across almost a thousand niches. And the reason is because my library is a fantastic source of content for authors. So whether you want to talk about you know, bodybuilding, diet, nutrition, or beekeeping, or you know, love, marriage, health, whatever the topic is, if you if you want to be an author, then you know you, you can more than likely I've got I've got content for that topic in my library and authors then obviously pick and choose because it's got it's got private label rights and you can use that content you can copyright that content and use it for your own. Um, a lot from this audience, you know, and I it's a bit of a risk me putting that that little line in there, but I do because there's there's always in fact um, Ken, if you're around, I'd just like a show of hands, please. If we have any repeat attendees or existing attendees, if you can, um, well, just, we, just just raise your hand. We do, um, and and in, and, in, and in fact, before you about five minutes, a few minutes ago, Mike jumped in in the chat. He says, "I'm a member of Genie Dream, and I love it." And Genie Dream is is the, always it, happens, always. Happens. Yeah. Every time I do a webinar, it doesn't matter who I do it for. There's always somebody on there who's already a member, or that I know, or has heard the webinar mm -hmm. before. You know. Um, it, it's just the way it is, and so I have no risk and no hesitation in putting that in there because every time there's always a repeat customer. Thanks for that, Ken. I will, will appreciate that. Yeah, I'm trying to. Um, I'm trying to. I'm trying to, see the, the, I'm trying to see the. I'm trying to see the question hands, but what, what's happening? My screen thing is getting weird too. So here we go. All right, now I can't I'm, I'm not going to raise mine because there we go. Yeah, yeah there's, there's, a few, there's, there's, there's a few. There's a few hands raised, so that's great. There is there. Fine. Yeah. Okay. Um, Okay, and you know anyone age seven and upwards, and that actually should be <coughs> eight now because seven was the youngest uh, age of uh, one of my members. Um, that, in fact, there was two or four younger than that. So they're probably they're probably eight or possibly they might not be slightly quite old. So you know the question here is uh, Mark Nadine says the, Mark Nadine says she's used three PLR books from Genie Dream so far, which were about 100 pages, and turned them into a 400-page product. So. <laughs> I have to give that a big round of applause. You know, those are the kind of feedback. That's the kind of feedback that, that really that I enjoy. That that excites me. That encourages me, and that gives me the enthusiasm to to do more from you. Know, that's pretty, yeah, it's that, great. That's it's it, it, well, it's per, it's perfect, Nadine. That's exactly the purpose of it. It's it's a great way to get I think started. We love you. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that brings us to the question. You know, look, why do they use it? Well, funny enough. Right at this point, we've just had Ken say, "Look, because uh, you know, Nadine used it for content and made a big, bigger and better product out of it." Um, you know, the other question is, "What is it that's so special about it?" Now, this is where we come to exactly what is PLR and what is resale rights. Now, resale rights, often called resale rights. Now, guys, listen to this very, very carefully. Pay attention. This is extremely powerful. Resale rights allows you to resell the product, not once, not twice, but time and time again, and you can retain 100% of the revenue. Now, guys, it's not rocket science, and you don't have to be a particularly intelligent person to realize and grasp the serious value of just that alone, and the power of just that. When I first got into internet marketing and I, and I and I came across PLR and Resale Rights product, which was for about three minutes over that three-day course. I circled those notes, and I put big stars next to it, and I thought, you know what? This is absolutely mind-blowing. If there is such a thing available out there that I can buy products with rights to resell them and keep all the money, I mean, you know, imagine you can make 500 Apple iPhones, resell them and keep all the money when somebody's already done the hard work and the due diligence and the... Um, research and development to, to, to build and produce these and now you can just literally go and copy them and you have the rights and the legal permission to sell them and keep all them up. Fantastic. I don't need to go on anymore. I think you understand what I'm saying. Now here's where it gets even better. I've got hundreds of thousands of PLR products, private life products. Now here let me give you an example for those who find that a bit a bit difficult to grasp. It allows you to label the product as your own product with your own name and brand on it, and you don't have to pay royalties. Now, there's an example here. We've got 
we've got Walmart in, in, in the USA, for example, um, and we've got Tesco's here in the UK. These are big, big, big departmental stores and not necessarily saying it because they're of any great repute or anything. Um, I, I've, I've recently uh, realized that Walmart doesn't have the best of reputations. That's what actually they were one of the best, biggest stores in the US, but anyway. But when you go into these stores, you'll see, you, you can count probably up to 2,000 lines that they have on the shelves with cornflakes, cereals, uh, ketchups, sauces, wines, tissues, all kinds of stuff, which will have their brand and their label on the product. But I promise you guys, they don't have 2,000 factories and 2,000 production premises. They don't make the beans and they don't make the cereals. They don't make the biscuits. And they don't make um, the tissues or whatever, the champagnes and the wines. They get other people to manufacture them and they put their own brand on it and they put it on the shelf. Now, if big, large department stores or stores, if they can do it very, very successfully, why can't we? Well, we can. And that's what I offer you guys. So here, again, again, these three slides are probably not the most important, but one of the most important in this whole, whole webinar. Imagine that I gave you the keys to Walmart. You had the keys to Walmart. And I said to you guys, walk in, have five trucks, big 40-foot articulated trucks outside. Fill them up, drive them away, go and sell all the product, keep all the money, come back, do it again, and there's no limit to how many times you can do it and how much product you can take and you can go and resell it and keep all of it. Wouldn't that absolutely blow your brains? What would those set of keys actually be worth if you could do that legally without three police cars waiting out there to arrest you? Those keys would be worth a lot of money. But guess what? That's what I offer you. I offer you the keys to my store. I give you a username and password to come into the library, download whatever you like, so you've got no cost for production, you've got no cost for storage, I'll store it all for you. You've got no staff. I'll explain that again in a second. You, you download all the products, build your own websites, sell it, keep all the money, keep coming back and having more. Isn't that absolutely brilliant? And I can hear a lot of people saying, if it's too good to be true, then it is. But you know what, guys, I'm telling you something. It could be too good to be true, but that's not the case. It actually is true, and it is too good. So normally, in an audience, I would ask you all to stand up. And, you know, I've, I've been in front of hundreds, thousands of people. This is, this, is, this is brilliant, and it works well on Ken's webinars as well, because we actually can do something on a webinar that we can really do live as well. And I hope Ken's around. So I'd say to you, stand up, and when I ask you, are you ready to be successful with me? I'd like everyone to give me a loud yes. All right, let's see if I can. Okay, so right? so I'm going to ask you guys, are you ready to be successful with me? Give me a loud yes. All right, we're screaming in the background. Woo! Woo well done. Thank you, Ken. And unfortunately, <laughs> I can't, I can't right unmute everybody. It's, <laughs> I, I, would have, I would have unmuted all of you for this. So hopefully you scream in the background like, and, and, and just woke up right up in your house. I know, I know some of you, some of you actually did scream in the back. I know you did. Yeah. See, Carol said I scream. So <laughs> that's great. Okay. You know, the reason, the reason I do this uh, in the live audience, and I'll be honest with you, it doesn't matter how interesting your content is. It doesn't matter how fantastically presented you are live on stage. When you look around the room, there's always one or two people falling asleep. There, there always is. And this is really kind of, kind of just sort of, get people back in again. All right. So some of you may be saying, yeah, we want to be successful with you, Mark. However, we don't find it that easy. And I would say you know, that it is when you know how. Right? You've heard that phrase, haven't you? It's easy when you know how. It's always easy when you know how. So, you know, you guys will be saying, well, Mark, you know, but if, again, it's easy for you to say, but you know, some of us don't know how. So this is where I ask for a volunteer. And um, in fact, we're going to do that. Yeah, we're going to, we're going to do this. We can do this live on a webinar. So Ken, um, okay, guys, who, 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 can we have a volunteer? Can you just, can you just raise a hand? Can we have a volunteer? Let's okay, who wants to, so, so Mark wants a volunteer. Yes, have a volunteer. Don't you, let's do, let's do, let's don't you uh, quickly pop in the chat, tell me who wants to volunteer. Okay, Mike is, Mike is volunteering. 
Mike, okay, I'm, I'm, I'm mute. Well, Mike. well, well hang on for a second. Do you, Mike, Mike already. Mike is a genie dream person. Do you want to? Is Mike is Mike disqualified or? Uh, let me just so I, 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 don't, I don't want to stack the deck. So no, 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 no. Is Mike, Mike okay? Mike, Mike is fine. No, okay, cool. No, All right. Remember, okay. Remember. Okay. Let me un let me unmute you, sir. Hang on one second. I just wanted to make sure that we didn't mess things up here for this example. So hang on a second. Where are you, Mr. Armstrong? Okay, Mike, you are officially unmuted. Oh, oh yeah. Hey, Mike, how are you, buddy? Ouch. Wait, a minute. I got it. I guess I got it. That's not working. Wait a minute. Where'd you go? Mute him, mute him, mute him. I'm trying to mute him. I gotta find him. He just, he, there he is. Whoa, bad news. Bad, bad, bad. Yeah, Mark, I can't, we can't make it work with you unmuted like that. Well, pick, pick, it's 100% set. Somebody else. All right, hang on. Uh, we're gonna give Mike, we, we'll give Mike a gift at the end anyway. Okay. So Mike, please, All right. so who else, me to give you a beautiful who else wants, gift for volunteering. Who else wants to volunteer that doesn't have static in the background? <laughs> we're gonna give Mike a $400 gift at the end just for being a top man and volunteering, but well, all right. the Mike situation. No problem, Mike. It's cool. You could probably couldn't do it. Yeah, let's <clears throat> okay. Well, here comes Nadine. And this is perfect because we can talk to Nadine about uh -huh. how she how Nadine. she put her book how she My put darling. her book together. I love Nadine. She's fabulous. Um she's like totally Tell cool. Let me let me let me, let me, let me go let me go let me go, let me go find you. Wait a minute. Why are we having to our... hang on a minute. I gotta like here we go. All right, I'm I'm now officially unmuting you, young lady. Okay, there we go. Hey Nadine. Hello, can you hear me? I can hear Hello, you, darling. Hello, darling. How are you? So nice to hear your voice. This is the beautiful lady who's really helping with my webinar. Thank you so much. No, oh, thank you. <laughs> are you are you are you ready to take part in this little uh, in this, yes. this little uh, activity interaction? Yeah. All right. Okay, now, yep. The, the the purpose of this is uh, just 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 to remind you, going back a couple of slides, is that you know a lot of people say, yeah, Mark, you know, we want to work with you, we want to be successful, we don't know how, and I would say to you, well, you know what, it's easy when you know how. Some people say, well, you know what, we don't know how. So, and 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 this this exercise is uh, just to show people that where this phrase like it's easy when you know how comes from, and if I teach you how to be successful in internet marketing then it's going to be easy because then you'll know how. Make sense? Yes. And I've got my teenager here with me because I'm trying to teach him how to do all this as well. Good. Ah, no, that accent. You know, I always get confused between Australian and South African. So either that's Australian <laughs> she is, she today, is, she's or South She's not in South Africa. Af she's, she's not in South Africa, I can promise you that. Ah, so she's a g'day. Well, I've got a bit of an I've got a bit of an everything accent because my parents were French, and so my family laughs now because they say I speak French with an English accent. Then people tell me I speak English with a French accent sometimes, and then so I'm a bit of everything. <laughs> there's a bit of South African, there's a bit of Australian. All right, anyway, look, Nadine. Yes. Pick a card, and in fact, you know what? I tell you what, we we. I'm going to get the whole audience. I want everybody to play along, right? I want everybody to pick a card. And what we're going to do, we're going to do a bit of twist to this magic. Instead mm. of instead of me asking you to pick a card and doing this magic trick with you alone, I'm going to try and do it with everybody on the line. That makes it like a million times more difficult, but we're going to give it a go. So right. I'd like you to pick a card. And I'd like okay, do I tell you? Um, no. No. Okay. No, keep the card a secret, and I want everybody in the in the audience, in the attendees, all the attendees, to keep it. Secret. <laughs> okay, you guys, you, you guys ready to play? Let pick me just a, make, pick let me, a card. Okay. Remember it. All right. Yep. Ready? Done. One, one, two, three, bang! And we're going to make your card disappear. Has it gone? Yes. It gone? Yes. It has. It and has. I promise you. I promise you. Everybody's <laughs> card in the audience. I've made everybody in the audience pick the same card. That's disappeared. Everybody in the audience, if your card's disappeared, please raise your hand. Alternatively, don't or, raise your hand. Or put it in the raise chat. Raise your hand if your card is still there. And I bet you no hands go up. <laughs> Ken, has any hands gone up? Nope. <laughs> nope. No. Everybody's card has disappeared. How fantastic is that trick? <laughs> okay, I'm going to show you how to do that trick. Oh, and in yes. the same way, I'm going to show you guys how to make money on internet marketing. So I don't want any excuses at the end of this webinar and in the next seven days. I don't want anybody to say to Ken or Mark, I haven't made any money because I'm going to show you how. Right? Okay. So this was the first row of cards that I showed you. And under 
with is the second rule of concert I showed you. Now, when you do a trick like this quickly, you can't see that whichever card you had picked, it would have disappeared because none of the top six appeared on the second selection. Mm. Clever, isn't it? Clever. So in the same way, we're going to show you how to make <laughs> money on, online but by being smart. So Nadine, now, yes. I'm not sure. Ah, we have got it. Now, you and Martin um, are going to get this wonderful DVD of 10 products that's worth about about three, four $400. So mm. remind Ken at the end, I'll give you a download link for this, so you'll get a meditation, health pack, social networking, internet marketing, pitfalls, business, golf, blah, blah, natural beauty, stop smoking, all these products you're going to get a free of charge for, for being a volunteer. Thank, Thank you very much, you Thank you. Okay, well done. Thanks, Nadine. Right. I appreciate your, uh, appreciate your help. Yay. It was tricky, wasn't we'll it? We'll carry on. <laughs> Stay close to your mic, Mark. You're getting, you're getting away from the microphone. Stay close, okay. Yep. Okay, now, now normally at this stage, we get another volunteer. Um, and the, unfortunately, we can't do this on, online. This can only be done on a live, live presentation. Um, but, you know, what we do, I'll, t I'll tell you what we do anyway. Here we do a live demo on the power of private labor rights and resale rights and how e-products are your cash flow, cash flow solution. And this is what we do. Can you, can you mute um, Nadine again? Oh, sorry about that. Sorry. No, I'm, sorry, I'm, I'm, I thought I was muted. <laughs> no, I, I forgot to mute you. Hang on, let me mute you back. That's all right. I'm just asking my, my boy for breakfast. Okay. Well, you can bring some for me too. He I'll made himself a bowl of soup, but he didn't give any to his mum. Ah, where the heck are you? <laughs> where are you? I can't. Let me know when you're muted. Uh... I can't find you, Nadine. Nadine, 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 Nadine if you can Nadine self mute, Nadine. if you can self mute, Nadine, that'd be cool because I can't find you. All right, <laughs> I don't know how do I do that. Um, wow, where the heck did you go? I I, I can't find People you. Can there, hear there's a, there's a little green, you. There's a little green microphone. What, what you do is you, you you go get some you go get some sellotape. Here we go. I got you. She's self muted. I got it. Strap it across your lips and you're muted. Okay. Done? Well done. Okay. Done. Now this demo, what we do live on stage, is, 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 is to prove that, um, uh, sorry, it's, it's, to, it's to show you the power of pre line resale rights and how e-products are your cash flow solution. Um, it shows you that e-products are licensed to print money um, and it, it shows that uh, you can set up your own e-product business that's capable of producing revenues 24/7 from as literally as soon as you know today this evening. Now we do this by a volunteer comes up and they leave the the room for about 15 minutes with my with my IT partner. They go to the back of the room. I have a, a, a laptop there. Now what happens is we we download a product from a product from the library. We take a picture of the of the volunteer and. A product then goes online that is now branded and labeled to that volunteer so it becomes his or her product it goes online and we typically pick you know a 50 or a hundred dollar product and then we offer it to the audience for like five bucks and we have a link which we put online for anybody in the audience who wants you know, for example a hundred dollar meditation disc set for five bucks. And when I do kind of like a, a rough calculation, I ask people in the audience, like, who would like to buy this for five bucks? Uh, you know, half the audience or 30% or X percentage of the audience put their hands up. Some of them actually give cash there and then if they don't have a paper account or anything like that. And they can download, we give them the download link. But basically the exercise is that within 15 minutes, that attendee has not only just put a website online with their own product, branded a pure life to their product, but actually made money. And the point of that is that if you offer a product of good value to an audience that wants it, which is really the basic fundamentals of any business, that if you ever offer a product to an audience, you make money. And it's a live demo. It's, you know, it may not sound that brilliant here on a webinar and online, but I tell you, if you see it live on stage, it's absolutely incredible that the audience are an absolute, you know, they, they, they just love it. Um, okay, moving on swiftly. Um, this is an example. The next few slides are just going to show you the quality 
of the product and the range of the product. Now, don't forget, I'm going to probably show you about 30 or 40 products, but I've got over a million. So this just gives you a rough idea. We've got JV Auction Profits, great graphics, great products. Instant Guru Status, so you know those that who want to become uh, a Guru Status and see shows you how to do it. The, the Inner Circle Secrets have now been unleashed, it says here. Um, we've got the one to three power system pro uh, three steps to fast wealth you know simple directions can you follow directions we've got spa music meditation gold sports again so you can see the great quality of the stuff this is a meditation set that retails at 97 dollars you can download these you can rebrand them you can make them into physical products and again we'll explain that in a second but again awesome value awesome product this is again to show you the high level high quality of social media products that we have um, you know um, I've used this library to to, to, to to learn I've taught myself so much stuff by downloading this product and just flicking through it myself um, we've got this whole set of web copy tactics upsell email marketing product creation traffic productivity social media again there's a whole set there that one's well, good. That one's good because you can take pieces out of that and use it for just about anything. That's exactly. and that's really yeah, really good. Pa 50 powerful, powerful tips. tips. That so that's what is that? that's like two, 375 tips or whatever that I saw there. Something like that. Crazy. Yeah. yeah. And then we've got your Facebook fan page. You know how to make beautiful Facebook fan pages. The uh, the other side of list building is a Russell Brunson $200 product. He sold he sold tens of thousands of those at 200 bucks each, and you can get that free from the library. We've got blogging guru, so if, you, if you're interested in blogging, there's an entire video uh, education uh, videos there that shows you how to make the best blogging sites out there, so lots of tricks, you know, how to make it, you know, uh, how to be more successful than other blogging sites, etc. We've got fast track to social media. Again, this is just a, a, a very brief across the board. Uh, I can't show you all of the products, obviously. So, you know, you, it's, it's kind of like, Excellent quality and a big choice product. And again, I've just bought this huge um, uh, package of um, just just reading books, basically. This is just story book reading books. Um, now, again, out of thousand niches, I've just selected a few here. So we've got action, adventure, figures, animals, articles, golf, health, history, hobbies, uh, music, philosophy, poetry, relationships, self-help, video, reading, weight loss. Blah 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 blah. So you get a rough idea of the kind of topics you've got. Pretty much any topic you can think of. Okay. So let's just talk about why, why PLR, and why resale rights. Well, look. First of all, it's very important that it speeds up your route to entry. You get instant revenue. We've talked about it. I've given you a couple of examples. I'll show you how we do that live on stage. It saves you two of the most valuable assets in any business, which is time and money. It's probably the best, quickest, and easiest way to build a list. You can educate yourself along the way from your product, which I've done. I've learned, I've mastered so much stuff without having to pay tens of thousands of dollars on buying other marketers' courses and packages and sending events and seminars, where you know, 90% of the content that they all have comes from products like this anyway. You know, so why 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 pay for that? I've educated myself for my own products and I still do. It complements any business of any kind, it's something for any niche. Professionally created by experts, they have sales pages written for you, they have graphic created for you. It's pretty much all done for you. And you know the good thing is that you can claim that it's your product. Now Guys, at this stage, I just want to tell you, we're, we're, we're an hour into this, and I'm still more than 15 minutes away, so please bear with me. I hope you're enjoying it, but, you know, I, I, I do like to deliver good content, so stay, stay with us. It will take a little bit longer than expected. PLR and resale rights has helped more internet millionaires to start up than any other strategy, and that's a fact. And it continues to do so regardless of niche. Ask Mike for saying, who has permitted me. Uh, that I can I can use his name in his slide um, because Mike Filsen actually started with PLI and Resale Rights himself. Um, and again, I can talk to you for about 10 minutes on that, but I won't keep you running out of time. Um, okay, now let's just go through some phases and phrases you may have heard, some, some, some things like squeeze pages, domain names, traffic, 
And, you know, the question I've put here is, does internet marketing confuse you? And it does. You know, some newcomers, it does confuse them. Uh, you know, are, are you overwhelmed by Google and Facebook and Twitter and YouTube and webinars and affiliate marketing and blogging and article writing and AdSense and AdWords and SEO and CPA and PPC and ABC and DBQ and, oh, my God, after a little while, you end up like this. And in England, we say it's enough to drive you do lally, and do lally means enough to drive you nuts. Um, it does drive a lot of people do lally, and it's driven me do lally, and it's driven me nuts, and I end up looking like this. And coincidentally, actually, I found these two pictures about six months apart. But isn't that brilliant and how similar they are? <laughs> the expression on their face is like, oh my God, they're so stressed um, and they're so confused. You know? So this is, this is what's happened. You know, having spoken to a lot of people in internet marketing, I, I do see lots of people, and I myself, I put my hands up, I was one of those. I was very stressed and very confused in my early days. But the message here is, look, and I've plastered, don't give up right across this website. Um, so a lot of people will say, all right, well, so, Mark, you know, what the hell do you do? What do you do? And here I've put a picture of a telescope. And the reason for that telescope is because I wanted to stay focused. That's what I did. You know, when I got confused, I stayed focused and I took things step by step. Um, and I wanted you to remember that whether you're online or offline, the principle, the concept, the foundation, the basics of any business are the same. Okay. And remember the other thing, that making money is not rocket science. If you've got a product and you've got the audience, it's going to make you money. It's really very simple. And the product could be goods or services. And the traffic, as we commonly call it in this uh, internet marketing business, is obviously the people or the buyer. So, you know, just keep it to absolute simple basics. Right product, right people, create yeah, make money. Okay. Um, let's just look at some revenue streams for a moment. Now, you can sell the product on your own mini site. And most products come with, or they have a done for you site that, that comes with the product. So it's got its own sales page. And then when you click the button page, it gives you a thank you page. And it's all there. It's all done for you. And I've put here, be smart. Now, this is how you can make money and you can be successful by being smart and not by working hard. You don't have to sit there for six months creating your own product and spending a lot of money. I've got millions of products there which you can use right away. You can make value bundles. When I first started, I put 50 social media products onto a disc, went to an exhibition similar to like an ideal home show where there was lots and lots, thousands of people. You know, it was, I was very new. I didn't know what, how many products I would sell. I took a risk. I took a gamble. I printed 100 discs. And by 2 o'clock in the afternoon, I'd sold them at $50 each, £50 pounds each, $75 each. And I walked away with £5,000 in half a day. Guys, it's an absolute fact. I've got pictures of the, the, the show that I attended. I've still got a leaflet of the products that I put on that disc, 50 social media products. I've got a nice poster saying $2,000 worth of social media products mm. you know, for 50 bucks. And you can make value bundles using my library, you know. Um, and add a lot of lot of value. You can convert products to CDs or DVDs, and I've done a lot of that. I've downloaded products and made physical products. In fact, I've got a guest with me here from from Watford, and I've, I've actually just given him some physical products that I've made by downloading them right here, right in front of us, right now. You can mix and create uh, a lot of stuff, and make home study courses. All these things are just being smart. You know, they're not they're not rocket science. You can create mini courses and you can distribute them to your mailing list. You know, you can make physical books. This is probably one of the million things that I haven't done. I haven't made any physical books, but a lot of my members have, um, and they've made money out of it. You can add affiliate links to, to PLR, and I put Be Smart you know, next to all of these. Now, I'm going to give you some examples of using. Now, you know, you know, these, these, these are just some revenue streams. There's lots and lots more. Um, let's just look at the uses. You can use them on a squeeze page. I don't know if you know that, that, that terminology, squeeze page, but that's a page where you have a little teaser, you have a, maybe a video or a short message, and then on the other side you have put your name uh, and your email address, and we'll give you this, this free product or products or whatever the case is or, or some information or some content. 
and you can get people's names and email addresses to build a list. And I've used this concept. I've used my products on squeeze pages to build lists of thousands, and it works. And I'm still every day now, you know, when, when I when I when I log into the email address where these go to, there's there's always about five or ten people every day, new members coming on my list that I'm interested in, in PLI and Lisa Rice every day. You can use PLI and Lisa Rice to promote a brand or any product. You can use them to add value. You can offer them as bonuses, and I, I do. I, I've done all of this. Uh, you can use it to JV. I mean, look, the perfect example is like Ken and myself right now. You know, I've done lots and lots of webinars. I've done lots and lots of joint ventures with people, and and that's rapid expansion. You know, amazing. Lots and lots of members come on um, through doing joint ventures. You can split as content to to various sites. You can make perfect niche bundles, which is like that show off that I was talking to you about. You can use it to upsell and downsell, and I'll explain that to you in a second. And you can use it to monetize part domains. Now, this upsell and downsell is a this nice graph, nice chart. You can just look at the top half for one moment, ignore the bottom half. Now, let's suppose you use a PLR product for a squeeze page, where it's a brief intro, could be a video or text. Collect the data, and it goes into your autoresponder or your database, which is your back end. Now, once they give you the information, the next page that they see, it could be an offer page. And that offer page could be a sales page. Um, it could be a, you know, at the bottom of it, you have an order now button. Again, collect that data. So now you know how many people have just done the squeeze page, got the free product and gone away. You know how many people have gone to the next page and bought the product. Um, and then you get the thank you and the download page. Uh, and of OTO means one time offer. Now, after they've downloaded the product that they've bought, I would always insist, and I have on 99.9% .9 of my sales pages, I always have a one time offer. And there's lots of reasons for that. It's similar going back to my, my video store, it's getting more dollar from the customer that's walked into your store. If somebody has just bought a product from from your online website, you've already you you, you know you've you've done ninety you, you in fact a hundred percent of the challenge you know all the obstacles you've already overcome them. The fact that the trust you've overcome is that to pull out his wallet is that to put in his credit card numbers you know, he's gone through all of that. Now if you've got a customer in that position and you've won him over for one product. What do you think is going to happen when you offer him a $500 product for $50 or $100? And he's already got his credit card out. You, the trust is already there. He's already bought something. A large percentage, an average about 25 or 30% of people, one in four, one in three people, will go on to buy another product off you. Why not get more money off that guy while he's there? Same concept as I have in my video store. I put uh, news agents, confession, tobaccos. While he's there for the videos, they buy this while he's there for that. They buy the other. And now again, you're collecting that information in your database as well. Now, if you just look at the second half, it's almost the same. We've left the squeeze page out. We've gone straight to the landing page. That's another way you can do it, because a lot of people don't like squeeze pages. They get put off. But if they see a sales page, they can see what they're buying. And if they want to buy it, they can. If they don't, they don't. Um, there's two things you can do. One thing is you can, once they've bought, you can go straight to the thank you download and the one-time offer. Now, on the second half, I've put second offer. You can do that. Don't do more. I've seen people go up to five and six offers, and you're just going to upset people and lose you. Third product of you, probably only another 10% of people. But again, there's still more dollar in the bank. You will get some sales. You know, borderline, will you upset them or not? It's a choice, choice you make. The other option is that once they've seen the landing page, if they don't buy straight from the landing page, then you can offer them the squeeze page. So as they log off, you'll get a pop-up to say, please don't go away. Here's a free product. Just give us your name and email address, and we'll give you this. And you know, a lot of people will then say, all right, fair enough. I didn't want to buy that product. But if I'm getting something for nothing, then you know what? I'll give my name and email address, and I'll get two ebooks for free or something like that. So this is extremely useful. And if you're not doing any of this now, and normally I'll have a little vote of who's doing this now and nobody puts their hand up, then please implement it because I think this is quite good content and nice bit of information which you should all use. All right. Um, okay, so 
let's just talk about affiliate marketing for a moment. This is why PLR and Resale Rights are so powerful for affiliate marketing. In the live audience, when I ask this question, who agrees it's a brilliant way to make money? A lot of the people in the audience will raise their hand. Um, I always get a very large percentage of people in the audience, and I'm sure I would hear as well if I did that test. A lot of people do affiliate marketing, and I'll tell you why they do that. Because the good thing is they they, they say to me, and when you interview a thousand people or a hundred people, they'll all tell you, Mark, the reason I do it is because the hard work, which is creating the product, it's already done. And they say, Mark, I mean, it's really easy. All I've got to do is grab a product, sell it, and I go 50-50 with the person that's, that's made the product or whoever's product it is. And, you know, all I've got to do, they say, Mark, all I've got to do is I've got to drive the traffic to it. Now, remember one thing, guys. The product provider, in this case, is often not even the creator. Is a provider, not the creator of the product, like me. Now, I'm providing you with a million products, but I'm not a creator of them. Okay? But he's earning, the product provider is earning 50% on not just your sales, but thousands of other people like you who have grabbed his product, driven traffic to it, sold it and gone 50-50 with him. So you can see what a such a comfortable position that he's in simply by providing a product. He reckons he's done the hard work, but really you've done the hard work by driving the bloody traffic to it. Sorry, shouldn't that buddy, by driving the traffic to it. Now the vendor not only gets 50% of your sales, but the vendor gets your clients, which is even more valuable. You've lost your client because now you don't have the person's details because all the details are going to his database. Now, the question I ask you is, how can you make affiliate marketing better for yourself and how can you be the vendor? Well, here you go. In fact, sorry, I have another question. How can you be at the top and get all those thousands of sales for, your, for yourself and the answer is easy using the library. Now, what you do, once you're a member of the library, don't forget, those products are now yours. You are now Mark Nathwani, basically. You've got access to that library, just like I have. So anything that I am doing right now to make money, and I'm making tons of it, there's nothing stopping you doing exactly the same. Make sense? So now you can get those products, put them on ClickBank or other similar sites. You can drive traffic to it as you would anyway, but the difference is now you'll keep 100% of the money. You don't have to share it with somebody. You, you can JV with lots of other list owners, let them market, let them do the hard work. The hard work really is not in creating the products, I'm just giving you a million of them. The hard work is really is in driving the traffic to it. Let somebody else do it. Invite affiliates on social media. All the upsells are yours. So now, do you know when I explained to you a minute ago how you can sell another product? Let somebody else drive traffic to your product. Let them buy it, so now you've got 50% for doing nothing. Then when they've bought it, take them to a one-time offer. But there's nothing that says that you have to share future sales with your joint venture partner. And nobody really does on the second and subsequent sales. It's only on that first sale. So all the upsells are yours. So 100% of the next product is yours. Do you see how powerful this is? Extremely powerful. This is brilliant for those of you that are already doing affiliate marketing. That's the majority of you. And you know the most important, forget one to five, you own the list. The money is in the list. Okay? Look, another way you can make money is webinars. And you know, one of my uh, members actually came up to me and I've put this slide, I always dedicate this slide to him because I think he's a brilliant, he's a genius guy. He said to me, Mark, do you make money with webinars? I said, yeah, sure I do. I do it all the time. He's not listening. I'm not asking you about the way you do webinars, I'm asking you about another way of doing webinars. And he explained to me what he does. Or what he did. He became a member of my site. This is his own idea, his own back. Very clever guy. He said, Mark, you know what? I didn't know anything about bodybuilding. I didn't know anything about six pack abs, but my brother was doing this P90X thing. And he said, Look, I wanted to know a way how I could sell these P90Xs and make a lot of money for it. Big thing, you know, everyone's buying P90X. So he downloaded some books from the library, all to do with bodybuilding. He picked this one which is dynamic six-pack abs. He then made a webinar out of it, out of this book. Brilliant guy, he made a, a one-hour webinar out of it. And now he needed an audience. Who is gonna listen to his webinar? He didn't have a list. 
So he picked up the yellow pages. You know, it took a bit of work, but the guy did it. And he called a lot of gyms, gymnasiums, um, you know, fitness places. And he said, look, do you have members? And he asked him a bunch of questions. The fact is, you'll find this the same with everybody. They have a bunch of members and they have a list, but they're dead. They don't do anything with it. The stores collect this database and they accumulate it. They shove it on the shelf and they let the members rot and they don't do anything with it. They don't have a mailing list. They don't keep in touch with it. So you know, I can, I'm going to spend an hour explaining to you how he did it, but cut a long story short, he got those people onto a webinar and in his first webinar, the guy made $1,200. How ingenious. And now he regularly downloads products. He did another one on beekeeping, honey, and he sold 120 pound pots of honey. 180 bucks. I mean, what kind of honey is that? Absolutely sweet. pure. Yeah, sweet. Absolutely pure. Fantastic honey. He did this webinar on beekeeping. Brilliant guy. So you know what? That's another idea. Um, so basically, guys, look, in summary, PLI and Research Rights, the world's largest in-product library is real. It's not a course. I'm not going to sell you a course for two or three days. I'm not going to sell you something that you're going to put on your shelf and forget about or that you won't have time for. And I say this because I see this is common in this industry. People like you, you attend webinars, you buy stuff, you don't use it. I'm sorry, but you know I've seen this. I've done it myself. So I'm not going to sell you or offer you any of this rubbish that you're not going to use or you're going to shelf or you're going to run out of time in two or three days. It's not something that you'll get from me just for one weekend. It's straightforward, incredible value. It's one of the best biz ops around. That's automated, which is important, and it operates from home. Can you see how powerful this is, guys? It, look, you've got no production cost, no postage, it's instant delivery, no storage, no staff. All the money you make is 100% bottom line. I'm going away for a month on Tuesday, and I promise you that I'll be sitting in Florida on the beach by the pool, and I'll be running webinars, and I can access it anytime from anywhere, and I'll be making money. So don't miss the trick, and don't get side pressing. Now, this is slide point number seven. When in our contents, when I said, if any of you are dozing off, then this is where I really shake you up and wake you up, guys. These are now, we're coming up to really the next 15 or 20 minutes. Bear with me, please stay there. Um, this is the incre in ingredients for online success, okay? Now, I've said mindset three times because you know what? I cannot emphasize enough, I cannot stress enough how important is mindset. And you know, I had a guy from the audience one day, put his hand up, and he said, Mark, I've got the mindset because I was, uh, because I've got the right mindset. Uh, in fact, I asked a question and he stood up and he answered and he said, uh, I was in the sauna, he said, last week with a bunch of mates. And so we had a we had a discussion for about 15 minutes on uh, on you know on, on what we're going to do. And he said he said Mark, I made my mind up. I've got the right mindset. He said I made my mind up within three minutes in the sauna that I'm going to be successful on online business. Now guys, that's not mindset. By mindset, I mean 24 hours a day, seven days a week positive thinking, visualization, and knowing what you want to achieve. That's mindset. Thinking about it in a sauna for two minutes is not mindset. And a lot of people think that that's it. Just because they've thought about an idea, they've got the right mindset. It's not. Okay. The other ingredient is product. You need traffic, obviously. Product and traffic is what brings you the money. You know what's important? It's a relationship with that list. And I'll tell you why. I've got a list of, say, I don't know, whatever. 50,000 people, and I give you that list, and I give you my product. And you'll say to me, Mark, you've given me your library, you've given me your list, but I've only sold five products and you sell 50. And the, the reason is because when I send an email to my list, they know me, we have a relationship, my response rate is gonna be greater than if you email to the same list because they don't know who you are. When they see your name come up, they may delete it. Make sense? So it's important to build a relationship with that list. And that's why when I build a list, I use my products to give 
value and build a relationship. So for the first four to six weeks while they're on my list, they automatically get free product. And then instead of deleting email from Mark Nathwani, they actually can't wait to get an email from Mark Nathwani because guess what? Mark Nathwani, Santa Claus, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, has just sent them another free product. And so on the eighth week, when I offer them a $500 product for $100, I'm going to get more response because now they, they like me, they trust me, they're looking forward to my emails, I've given them a lot of free stuff, and they'll take my emails a bit more seriously. Relationship is very important. Coaching is another thing you need for online success. I've needed a lot of coaching and a lot of guidance myself. You obviously need education. You know, I've taught myself from my products, I've taught myself from buying some products, but you need education. I've had to develop, unfortunately, as much as I hate tech and stuff, I've had to, I've had to acquire, learn, um, and get to know some basic tech and skills, you know, just, just to get by. You need an autoresponder, which is an email management system. It's a tool you can use. Outlook is okay for up to a thousand people on your list, if that, pushing it. Once you get to more than that, don't use Outlook. Try not to use Gmail or any stuff like that. You need a proper, uh, you know, email email management system like uh, there's loads out there ranging from twenty five pound a month all the way to infusion software just three three hundred fifty pound a month. But you, you need something. Um, you can only host a certain amount on your on your local desktop or your local laptop. But then you need a professional hosting system, and obviously you need a payment processor to collect the dollars, which is always a great idea. No point having all this if you can't collect the money. So basically. These are the ingredients that you need for online success. Nothing more, nothing less, okay? Let's just talk about each one separately for a moment. My mindset has got me through many, many challenges. So guys, with the right thought process, you can achieve your desires. And you know, I can, I can, oh, I can do another two hour webinar just on mindset, but we're gonna cut a long story short. This is probably one of the world's best mindset sort of education systems. It's a 24 part mastermind course, which is about $400. Make a note of it and go and buy it. Please, I'll show you in a minute where you can get it for not anywhere near that price. Don't just buy it, please. I have to insist, actually do it, it'll change your life. It's, it's the product that the law of attraction, the secret originated from, okay? It's brilliant stuff. Um, please don't do this now but I'd like you to go to YouTube um, and just type in Mark Nathwani testimonials. Um, and there's one here, absolutely brilliant guy, Todd Morgan. In fact, if you put Todd Morgan testimonials, literally not rehearsed, I flicked out a camera. I said, say a few words, the guy will have you in tears. He talks about how I helped him using the master key system. Absolutely changed his life. The guy was really as low as you can get. Um, anyway, have a look at that later. The other ingredient was product. Well, you may well have product, however, you'll find, and it's very important that, uh, guys, can you hear me? I've got a message coming up. You may be experiencing degraded audio quality on your recording. Please choose any unused internet application. Are you guys there? Can you hear me? Ken, are you there? Have I lost you? Are you still with me? Somebody talk to me. Can somebody unmute themselves and just, uh, we've lost connection. Thanks. Sorry guys. Uh, are you there? I'm here. I'm here. I just step away for a second. You're there? Good. Yeah, you can okay. everybody hear me? Fantastic. Okay. okay. Brilliant. Great. Sorry. I just got a message on my screen saying you've got audio problems. So I should carry on. I should carry on. Thank you very much. Okay. So you'll find that you can never have too much product and you can never have too much content. You know, most marketers will talk about PLI and resale rights and product being so key to any business. Guys, don't underestimate, you know, the value and importance of product. And I'll tell you why, because, you know, I used to say I'm approaching a million products. Now I quite happily say I've exceeded a million. I can't get enough. I'm still adding more. Uh, the other ingredient to online marketing success is obviously traffic, and I've just listed a few ways you can get traffic, and that's joint ventures, search engine optimization, video, mobile marketing, AdWords, media buying. You know, with AdWords and media buying, be careful, although it's instant, 
it can cost you a lot of money and you can end up losing your shot if you don't do it properly. So be warned, don't go and spend lots of money on AdWords and Media Brain until you've downloaded some products from the library and studied it and become a master in it, and then you can do it. Hint, hint. <laughs> okay, coaching. You know, if you get any coaching for less than $1,000, uh, be a bit wary. It's not going to be the best coaching. Anything under a thousand is going to be, you know, not 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 that brilliant. You can expect to pay about a thousand for five. Now, um, I also mentioned basic techie, um, you know, just just some, some some techie stuff. There's a fantastic DVD set which shows you how to download the product all the way to testing the payment link. You can expect to pay for 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 a course like that about two to three hundred dollars and there's this let's make money is a good one it's my own brand it's my own product it's a brilliant brilliant dvd and i'll show you where to get all of this stuff might as well tell you now i'll be honest with you oh, pretty much well or nothing in a minute <laughs> i've done i've told you uh you need an autoresponder which is really the engine or the heart of the system and hosting can cost you anywhere from twenty dollars up to i pay now over a thousand uh, pounds, which is about fifteen hundred, two thousand dollars a year, obviously because you know it's a big business and I need a lot of help. Now, education. You can either spend tens of thousands of dollars on buying other people's mm -hmm. products, um, going to seminars, and you know, or you can buy a home study course like this and expect to pay about fifteen hundred dollars. Or there's another example here. There's another one, uh, which is Internet Business Basic. The other one is an Internet Millionaire System. And both of these products typically 26, 28 past systems is going to cost you about $1,500. So let's just go through those products again very, very quickly. Mindset, you really shouldn't start without it, wasting your time. Product, whatever your niche. Traffic, uh, plus ways to build a relationship. Coaching, education, techie skills, autoresponder, hosting, you can't really start without it. Payment processing, if you don't have one, use my PayPal, I'll collect your money. <laughs> boom, boom. And if only somebody, yeah. Uh, this is complete. Look, if only somebody would hand you all of this on a plate, could you make money? Now, again, if we had time, I'd ask you all to vote, and I'm sure every single hand would go up. Um, but just a nod of your head would be good for the time being. You guys can but pop in the chat on that, by the way. You guys can I've completely got a, I've pop got a in the chat. Look, it's a show of hands. Yeah, look, that's, sorry, Ken, did I interrupt you? Say that again. No, I said, go ahead, you, pop in the chat. Does this make sense to you guys? Yeah, do it. There we go. We're getting look, yeses. Absolutely. Oh my God. I want yeah. a show of hands. Absolutely. Those that want to make smart money with me today. And now here, this is where we come to my golden rules. Do you remember right at the beginning I said, remember this? Because if I don't give you good value and if I don't give you good service, then I've failed miserably because I'm about to blow your socks off. Now, <laughs> as a loyalty bonus, right? Get ready, guys. If you're half asleep, now's the time to wake up. That master key product that I was telling you about, that was costing about 399 free for everybody. Everybody online today that joins up, I'm going to give you that free, okay? Let's make money. Do you remember that one I talked talk about a minute ago? $300 worth of product, teach you from download to payment link, free. Ah, oh, look at that. Do you remember that $1,500 home study course that I was telling you about? I'm going to throw that into the mix. So now I'm going to give you all the ingredients that you need to be successful online. I am going to give them to you, all of them, one by one. You can have them all at the same time, by the way. Coaching. I said to you, you can't get coaching for much less than a thousand bucks. I've got a coaching program, which I've sold for a thousand dollars. It's absolutely brilliant. I'm going to throw that in. Now, on top of that, I'm going to give you a beautiful, fantastic sideline. You can use this, and I can talk about this for another half now, but you can have your own WordPress tutorial business, which you can turn into your own live workshops. These are 60 how-to videos on almost any topic that you can imagine. That includes blogging secrets, and how-to, control panel, dashboard. I know Ken loves this product because, Ken, I know you've made a ton of money it's a great it's a it's a it's a great it's a great product it, the, it really from is from the time you saw this i know you've actually milked this and you i love Ken it is living proof that you can make money out of this and he actually has right so if you cannot then talk to ken he'll show you how to make money with it 
Now, normally by this time the live demo comes back with the website ready, so I thought I'd just uh, I'll, I'll just um, let you know about that. Now, the message here, guys, I'm, what I'm saying really is, if you really if you want to be real smart, start a membership e-store immediately. My advice to you: if you really want to make money using my library, or you want to make money generally, a membership e-store is the best way to make money. And I'll tell you why membership sites are the best, because it's recurring revenue. Every single morning, guys, and I kid you not, and I've got a pal sitting here with me, and I've showed him many, many times, on my email, on my Outlook, I've got anywhere from minimum 10 to up to 50 or 60 every day people paying, on, on a, depending on whenever they're doing work. If I, if I just had one member per week paying me £10 per month, I'd have £520 per month if I get one member per week. So 52 weeks at a tenner, I'd have £520 per month coming. If I had three members per week paying me 20 I'd have $3,000 per month coming in. That's not a lot, you know, three. If I had 250 members, period, okay, just 250 members, that's all, paying me only $20 a month, I'd be earning $5,000 per month. Now, guys, again, I'm not trying to impress you, but just figure this out yourself. I've got nearly 3,000 members, and I had almost 1,000 in my first year of being in this business. Can you see the power of having a membership? Now, the reason I'm telling you, it, there's going to be a massive, huge bonus gift at the end. And it's, it, it's kind of based around this. So just stay with it, guys, because this has changed my life. And the way I've packaged this entire webinar and this entire offer has made it very, very, very easy for you guys. And that's a fact. Now, usual at this stage, before somebody offers is a little bit of proof. These are genuine screenshots. I've done a webinar with Russell Bronson. I've mentioned him, you can ask him. In 48 hours, we made 60,000 pounds. That's $90,000. I did $4,000 in just one day in another webinar. I've done both of those. But that's, that's proof, that's accurate. Right. So here, I'm going to ask you a question. I want to volunteer, okay? Um, and again, this is one of my absolutely happy, confident, take a risk bits where I've not gone wrong so far where somebody volunteers and they explain without any difficulty the power of this so far and what they can do with it. You know, I always ask for a volunteer and they say, oh, Mike, oh, Mark. So they say, yeah, I can do this, I can do this, I can do this, I can do a membership site. There's so much stuff I can do. I'm so excited. I can't wait to get on. So I'm going to ask for a volunteer who thinks this is worth as much as anything else that you've seen so far, if not more, who will volunteer to tell us what they can do with it. So, uh, Mr. Kennedy, if you can find somebody. Okay. Who wants um, to volunteer? volunteer just, just tell us what they can do with it. I see, and I do, Carol. I'm not sure whether you want to get married or – okay, Gail does. Perfect. Okay, great. Let me unmute you, Gail. Uh, let me find you. I'm so glad you're back. Let's see. Here we go. Okay, here we go. You are now unmuted. Hey, Gail. Hey, Gail. Can't hear you. You haven't unmuted her. I did unmute her. Why not how to unmute? Gail, are you there? Is your mic working? Sam says this is damn powerful. <laughs> Okay, Gail, I can't, I can't hear you. I'm going to have to go to some, the next person. Sorry. Okay, I'm muting Gail back. And let's see George, which is perfect alphabetically right below Gail. Okay, hey, George, are you there? George? Wow, I'm muting, I'm muting everybody here. George, are, are you there? They, they probably don't have a mic, but are uh, they volunteering? Yeah, yep. Yeah, but I'm muting and George, and George isn't. Okay, I'm going to keep you. George, let's try Sam. Let's see. How strange. People are not being able to speak today. Okay, here we go. Wow. All right. Sam, are you there? Very unusual. Sam? Wow, this is strange. Oh, Sam's got this no mic. Weird. Sam's got no mic. Okay, I'm going to mute. I don't need to mute you. Then you got no mic. Somebody with a mic. Okay. Um, 
Okay, so, uh, there's a question from D. Riches, but I'm, I want to know, we're, we're doing the volunteer now. Who wants to, okay, Ryan, let's see if we can get Ryan. Here we go. Right here next to you. Let's see, hopefully you got a mic. Okay, Ryan. Well, can you hear me? There we go. Oh, okay, well, thank goodness. Okay. All right. <laughs> hey, uh, I can. I, I know we could do a whole, a whole bunch of stuff with this. You know, you can use it for uh, uh, setting up an autoresponder sequence. Use the uh, the products for that, or you could use them for uh, writing articles um, and uh, or blog posts. Use uh, spin the articles. Um, you know, you can set up a member membership site with uh, content uh, and drip feed the content. Um, you could use the books, um, you know, you, you could create new uh, new covers and just uh, recreate these, uh, sell them on Amazon, Kindle, uh, and, and, and it goes on. Create videos from the articles uh, that, that they have in there, create videos. There's a lot of good stuff. Yeah. Excellent. Fantastic. There's really... You know, you're going to get you're, you're going to get the volunteer video as well. Thank you oh. very, very much, Nick. Awesome. So That's much. well appreciated. Well done, well done. Thank you. You know, this is, uh, the reason I do this is just to show everybody, all the attendees, that you know what? If you can pick up 15 ideas which you've just literally just run off on the top of your head without any thought process by listening to this uh, webinar for the last sort of hour, hour and a half, then, you know, it, 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 there, there has to be some goodness in it. You know, you've just come up with like 15 ideas. Can anybody in these attendees, can anybody just use one of them and make money? The answer is absolutely yes, and you know you've got to pick one. So you know, well done. Thank you very much indeed for that, buddy. Yeah, thank you. There you go. Well done. All right. Thank Thanks, you. Ryan. Awesome. Thanks, Ryan. Okay. Um, usually, again, at this stage, uh, before the offer, you'd, you'd have a few testimonials. I'll tell you one thing now. All my testimonials have the names. You can Google these guys. You can Facebook these guys. You can ask them are these uh, testimonials real, um, un 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 induced, if that's the right word. I've not. I've not. You know gone out and asked for them. These, these are people that have just sent me their testimonials. So I'll just read them at you very quickly. Um, spending time with you after working with you has qualified what I first thought about Genie Dream. You and your team are the best I've ever worked with. Thank you. Your site is massive and so organized. On top of that, your help is fantastic. I'd recommend your site. It's the best deal I've ever found on the internet. You've caused me to put up my first website. I'm on the way to the stars and I shall tell your story to all those that come to my site. Thank you for your guidance by Ray Terror. Real guy, and it's his own words. It was a great weekend, and great to meet you, Mark. You struck me as a person who really cares about the people on your program and wants to help them to succeed. Best wishes by Ian Flood. Again, absolutely genuine. This story, ugh, I wish I had the time. I'd love to spend five minutes on this slide, but cut a long story short. I refused this 16 year old girl my membership. I didn't want her father to come and punch me in the face and say, why did you take a thousand dollars, a thousand pounds actually, fifteen hundred dollars off, off my daughter who doesn't have a clue what she's doing. She got her dad on the line. I got permission from her father. I put on the receipt, you've got 30 days money back guarantee. I took the money on the credit card so if she had a problem she could go to the credit. Anyway, cut a long story short, she's now married to my ex-business partner, Soho Khan. Um, she made six thousand pounds nine thousand dollars in 16 days of joining and i thought she knew nothing about my library she listened to my live presentation true story um eva sherman is her name she's now called eva Khan. and peter padfield put this is an actual facebook cut and, uh, cut and paste eva you're awesome 16 days six thousand pounds one of the most powerful stories i've ever heard and even more impressive for your sweet modest uh, uh, demeanor and she says, I, I started my journey using Mark's library 37 days ago and I've experienced some phenomenal success. It's amazing what you can achieve if you put your mind to it. Young girl, didn't know anything about it. There's a video there which I can't play, unfortunately, online. Um, uh, but again, it's on, it's on YouTube, so have a look at it. Um, if these are some extracts out of some others. Uh, I'll just run through this very quickly. Mark, you have a very effective and straightforward access to real products 24-7. Uh, another one said very useful, affordable, and flexible product. Again, you know, these are key words useful, affordable, and flexible product. A million free products blew me away, said somebody else. You have some incredible stuff there, bro, he said. Allows you to start or build on your. See, again, they've chosen some words really nicely. It allows you to start or build on your business now. So whether you're a newcomer or existing, so I chose that, it's very good. Start, starting to make money excites me. Uh, increasing my sales already. Now this is a brilliant one. 
I wasn't sure when I joined, and I'm glad I did. And I put this there deliberately because so many people say, you know, I'm not sure. They're indecisive. They can't make their mind up. So if you're there, just do it because this guy wasn't sure when he joined, and he's glad that he did. And another one, this is again one of my favorites. You're not kidding, Mark. World's largest collection of what he says. So, you know, I can hear what you guys are all saying now. You're all probably saying, Mark, I like it. I can clearly see brackets. I can recognize the opportunity. And it's important in life to recognize an opportunity, uh, you know, and make a decision. And what a vital tool this is for anyone in business, whether it's online or offline. And the question here probably is, Mark, how much does it cost to join your library, uh, your peer library, so rights? Well, you know what? I'm still going to keep you in suspense for a couple more slides. Um, because I'm going to ask you a question. Is it price or value that really matters? How much is it? It shouldn't really be the question. How much can it make me should be the question. You know, you should be sitting there thinking, you know what? It doesn't matter what it costs. And I'll tell you why it doesn't matter. Because it's taken me three years and over $300,000 to build. So really, if you know how much is it, that's how much it is. It's three years and $300,000. You're not going to pay that. And I'm not going to ask for that. So that's irrelevant, the cost, because even up to that value, it's worth it because that's what it's cost me and I'm making money on it. Do you make sense? Yeah, makes sense. So really the question should be, how much can it make me? That's, 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 that's the crucial bit. So if you think positive, one sale from all of this product, you should be thinking to yourself, one sale from all this product can make me, you know, X amount. If you saw one mic for the same as Butterfly Outsource, you could make it 2,000 bucks because that's what he sold it for. And you know what? Sell it for half the price. Sell it for 75% off for Christ's sake. Make 250 bucks on it. It's still 250 bucks on one sale. But a clever strategy or one strategic partnership, and you can add a zero to that figure, whether you're online or offline, you can use this for online or offline. You can do that instantly. And this is where my my, my news actually comes in, in in a moment. So let's just summarize what you're going to get before I tell you how much you're going to pay for it. A full library access, I've sold on stage for 1500 but with the diamond section, it's, it's, it's $2,000 all day long. The WordPress business is a $500 product. Um, I've got a PLR video business, which I haven't shown the slide for. I'll, I'll throw that in as well. And that's absolutely unbelievable. These are four videos, PLR videos. I'll explain to you. Uh, I, what I'll do is those that, that sign up, I'll explain to them what you can do with this. It's, uh, because we're short of time. Otherwise, I would have explained it. But it's, it's phenomenal. Each video is about two or $3,000 each. And there's about six of them. And I'll show you how to make a ton of money out of that. Um, I'm going to give you that world's leading uh, mindset program, which is uh, undoubtedly it is the world's number one program. That's where all this component of and uh, uh, law of attraction and the secret and all of this has come from the master key system. That's a fact. Um, I'll give you the less make money DVD. I'll give you, you know what I'll do? I'll give, for the first year, I'll give you unlimited hosting um, and that could save you up to $2,000 for the whole year. I'll give you that completely free. I'm going to give you both of the home study courses. And you know what, guys? I'm actually going to give you access to my entire investment of $300,000. Right? You're going to get that. So that's $311,000 worth of stuff. Now, here's a real kicker. A million products, even if you put a dollar value on each one, and you know and I know that the average is more than a dollar. There's a million dollars worth of products right there. I'm going to give you a mystery gift that if you haven't been totally blown out of the water already, then this really will completely put the nail right in the coffin and seal it right there. And I'm going to give you my 30 day wealth creation blueprint program as a bonus as well. Okay. So there's, there's, I'm, I'm keeping up to my word guys. <laughs> Now, you know, Mike Filsen is one of the guys that advised me of this amongst many others who've, who've said that I'm actually a fool. They say, Mark, you're actually underselling and undermining your own product. You shouldn't be giving it away or selling it for what you are. You should actually be charging at least $5,000 for the access, or if not, then at least charge people about four or $500 per month because they can make that 
by selling just one or two products. And you know what? They're actually right. But I'll share with you why I don't do that. Now, as an event promoter myself, I've been an event promoter. I'm in a great position. And I see what you as an audience, I can see what you as an audience want and at what price. Because, you know, when I'm at the back of the room and I've got a team of sales staff and the speakers just come off stage, I have heard and seen thousands of people say, you know what, I want to go with that speaker. I want to work with him and I want to take his course and I want to take his product. But I don't have $5,000. I don't have $10,000. So I don't want people to say that about me. I don't want everyone in this audience today to say, Mark, you know what, I really want access to your library and I really want to work with you, but I haven't got $1,000 or I haven't got $1,500 or I haven't got $5,000. I don't want to work with two or three of you. I want to work with all of you. So that's why I don't charge a lot of money. And the other reason is, look, and this makes a lot of sense. If I sold it for $20,000, if I said to you guys, right, okay, it's $20,000, how many will I sell to you? Maybe one? Maybe none? You probably all say, fair enough, can't afford it. If I sold for 3000 I may probably get one or two. But as I go lower in price, I want to get to a stage where all of you say, it's a no-brainer, I'm having it. So if 50 of you join up, I'll make more money from 50 than I would from maybe just one or two. Does that make sense? Absolutely, perfectly makes sense, doesn't it? And you know, the other thing is I want to help lots of people, not just a handful. And what I don't like is when I see speakers standing up on stage and they think they're being proud, they know they're proud of themselves and they say, I don't have the capacity to work with everybody in the room and I just want to work with a handful of people so I can give you my time and my attention and whatever excuse they come up with but I just want to work with a handful of people. Come on. Who are you trying to pull the wool? Whose eyes are you trying to pull the wool over? You know, it doesn't work like that. I want to help lots of people. Now, the other reason, and again, all these make perfect sense. Guys, I've done the hard work. I've created this library. It's cost me 300 grand. It's taken me two or three years. I've done what I have to do, and it's making me money. And what I want you to do now is to take advantage of me and the library and use it and make some money. So the question, how much can you make from it? Well, I made $300,000 as an absolute fact in my first year. And I've reinvested over that in the last few years. Then what is it worth? Is it worth $5,000? Yeah, damn right. Is it worth half of that? Yeah, it is. If it's worth five, then it's certainly worth well, 50. This scale should be the other way around, but anyway. Yeah, it really what should. What I'm going to do, <laughs> yeah, what I'm going to say, you can take the whole lot now, start making extra income from home, like me, and thousands all over the world, unlimited lifetime use, including the future products for... This is where the announcement comes in, guys. I've not done this slide before. I've put this as a brand new slide. This is hot off the press, and I don't know if you've got Ken's email, but I have a special announcement to make, and I'm damn excited about this, and I've been working on this for about six months. Now, normally, on this slide, you'd get the price and the sign-up link, all right? But I've replaced this slide with this announcement. Today. Now, I've signed up a deal where I'm going to get minimum $500 up to a maximum of $1,000 per member. And I've been promised at least a couple of thousand members on the low side and at least a thousand members on the upside. So you can see what this deal is worth. And this is a genuine deal. It's not one of these things that you see on Facebook or your mail out saying I've just done a seven figure deal and I've done a million bucks and two million bucks and five million bucks and ten million bucks but I can't afford a five dollar coffee which is common. You hear this all day long. Guys I'm really excited about this. this is actually true. After all these years and working on this deal for six months, we've agreed it. I'm it's gonna be huge news in the next I'm going away for a month on holiday. Otherwise it would have been announced like literally in a couple of weeks, but you'll have to wait till I get back. That's per client, and that this, this is wholesale, by the way, guys. You know, a, 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 a massive organization that has thousands of members that they've charged thousands of pounds for, and what they're doing to add value, serious value, so that they can charge their customers 
two and a half, four, five, up to ten thousand dollars to join their package. They're what they're doing is they're they're giving my library away to them as a like a bonus, but then they're paying me from their fee a large amount of money. Very, very exciting. I'd normally charge when I'm speaking on stage fifteen hundred dollars plus forty five pounds a month. Now I'm gonna reveal the price to you. Now I'm going to tell you what you can get it for, not even 1500 497 but before you go to this link, do not go to this link yet, and I'm sure you're going to go to the link. It completely mess up my offer now. And I was going to do this offer just for the volunteers for 297 plus $10, not 497 plus 10 and you know, I had a chat with chat with Ken about this, and uh, and a few webinars ago, we made an in, a, a big cock up. We made yes, big yes, mess. we did. Yes, we did. And everybody online ended up getting this deal for two ninety seven instead of four ninety seven. And Ken said, "Mark, you know, please don't make this mistake again." And then I, I don't know exactly what happened, but it happened again. <laughs> and yes. Ken said, "Look, for Christ's sake." Instead of you making this cock up, now what I'd like you to do is cut the crap and just offer it to everybody for 297. So I'm not going to make that mistake again. But yeah, look, this is what I did. In fact, I've left this slide here for you guys to see. This is genuine. This was a complete cock up. And what I did was I offered other people on the webinar, right, two other people on the webinar. This is what I said. And I said, look, if the, web, if the volunteers don't want it, I'll offer it to somebody else. And I said, who else would like it for 297? And I didn't think, we didn't know what's going to happen. And I was expecting one or two people to say, you're all right, you know what? If the volunteers don't want it, I'll have it. And it ended up like almost everybody, wasn't it, Ken? It was like 98% of people. It was, said it was, it was amazing, yeah. If the volunteers don't want it for 297, I'll have it. Uh, Ken and I thought, crikey, you know, we never thought about this, you know, you know, what would happen if more than two people said they want it? And then in the end, Ken, do you remember, we just let everybody have it. Yeah, we did. So there it, you go, it, was, it was insane. It was absolutely insane. So, yeah, absolutely. So you know what, guys, whether you're a volunteer or not a volunteer, I've made that mistake before. Ken said, don't cock it up by doing that twice. Just please just offer it to everybody. For just, just, just Nike so, it. Just do it. Go yeah. now. Go now and do it. Now, you know, what I've done differently now is that those that go and sign up, and by this stage, honestly, the results we've had have been, I, I, I can actually prove it to you. I can, I can, I can go into my, <laughs> I can actually go into my, pa uh, my paper now and show you. It, it's literally, Ken, I think we get over 90% success rate on your, um, on your webinars. And it's because it is actually, it, it's such a stupid no brainer deal that people realize they're not silly there. You know what? This is genuine. It works. It's yeah. worth the money. It's and I, I put the I put the link in the chat area for you guys, so you can just hit the hit the button. Um, yeah. Something to I just guess, just 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 go and do it. Yeah. Uh, sorry, go on. Let me also share a couple things with you. Um, the, we, we, we changed our technology a little bit for the order processing today, so you're going to see an order not going through our cart. Uh, so when the when the um, PayPal thing comes through, it will not be our Totalpreneur account PayPal. And our, and our technology has not worked well for the past 24 hours. So um, we're, we're processing through one of my partner's accounts uh, until the our new PayPal app is approved. Strange, but anyway, so you'll see that it'll be a little bit of a difference for you. After you complete your sign up, you're going to be taken straight to Mark's site, to geniedream.com, uh, and you're, you're being taken to a specific page that is just for us. So after you complete your transaction, when you get there, then sign up. That's on Mark's site, um, so that way you'll have instant access tonight or this morning, wherever you are, to the library. Now, something I want to make sure you're really clear about, because it, it is it is potentially confusing, and because we always get a support ticket from at least one person about this. Okay, when you go into the library, there's so much stuff in there, and there's all prices on it because it's actually Mark's real site. It's Mark's live site. When you're logged in. To the site there'll be prices next to everything and you'll still select what you want when it comes to checking out it zeroes out okay your membership does zero it out so don't freak out going oh my gosh this thing was 39 dollars or whatever no that's retail price because mark uses that to sell this this these products 
So when you get to the checkout area, it will zero out for your membership. Okay, so I want to say that, I say that again so that you don't go freaky because I did myself and I knew that it was all included and I was like, wait a minute, why am I, you know, so you're going to go through a checkout process, not a problem at all, downloads, everything's good and you will not pay for any of the products because you're getting it with this. Okay, so I want to make sure that that was handled for all of you. Uh, also, let me also add something as well because Carol asked about how to put your label on the PLR. Um, for all of you that join today, I will invite you to come Monday to our strategic, I'm sorry, not Monday, next Monday, rather. We do it twice a month. We do a strategic implementation sessions for our clients. And so I'll invite you to come. If you're a site rec customer, you'll be in that anyway. But what I'll do is I'll talk about PLR, how to use the PLR, um, how to brand it, how I use PLR because I use it a lot. Um, and I will want you to be rebranding everything that you do. Absolutely. Mark, whatever you're doing back there, don't do it. You can make a noise. Oh, um, sorry. sorry, sorry <laughs> okay. So. Um, so in any event, uh, we will we will comp you in to the next strategic implementation session so that we can talk about PLR and it'll mean a whole lot to you. Private label rights is the foundation for how I began my business. Um, and I mean, and I still use PLR regularly. I use PLR for software. Now, SiteWrap is my own, by the way, so I don't think I, that, that's PLR. No, no, SiteWrap, we developed. But we've taken other people's product, other people's software, and aggrandized it and used it and customized it. I'll always encourage you to do that. And we'll talk about how to do that when we see you a week from Monday uh, or Tuesday if you're if you're on this side of the world like I am. So go now right ahead to totalpreneur.com forward slash PLR. If you would, pop in the chat. Tell me that you're in um, so that we know who's coming in because I can't see the detail given that we're not going through my shopping yeah, cart tonight. It, it, so can, just, can I interrupt you? It is very important for people to, to just to message if you're in because I'm about to really give those that are in uh, something really, really special as a gift. Okay, so really Gail, special. so just, Gail's just, in. Just, just let us know. Say, hey, Sylvia. Um, yes, yeah, Sylvia. You, if you if you need to do it tomorrow, that's fine. It'll it'll be up for for another day or so while we've got it. Tony's in. Uh, fantastic. Do you, do you uh, not want me to take the link off this evening? Then? Uh, so what do you mean take? Now you can link, leave a link. Uh, 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 okay, I'm, glad you, I'm glad you told me that because normally I, after about an hour. I, I can't even speak. Yeah, I'm, I, I need to give her till tomorrow. It's it's, it's Sylvia. Okay. I'll do I'll okay. do like anything for Sylvia. So yeah, just make sure you ha you handle it tomorrow. So what I'm going to do, what I'm going to do, Ken, because I'm going to switch off this link. I'll give you another one for Sylvia for tomorrow. Okay, no problem. So if you if you have an issue, this just, is only for those. This is only for those that 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 sign up now. Okay, yeah, because we because I am recording this. So the, if you're on this recording and your link does not work, my apologies because the, you know this was time sensitive. But just email me if, or email support support at totalpreneur .com and we'll see what we can do. What what Mark's currently doing, um, Ryan is yeah. So yeah, Ryan, send it send an email if you would, because that way Rose can take care of it to support at totalpreneur .com support at totalpreneur.com and Rose will, Rose will get it to you or she'll get it to me to Mark to get to you because they'll go to webinar chat box goes away pretty quick. Okay. Nancy's in the fantastic. Okay. So just, you just put in the chat, let us know that you're coming in so that we can track it. Cause again, as I said, it's not going through my cart this time. Um, we're, we, we have some really great technology that we use with PayPal and uh, we opened up a new account for our totalpreneur brand. And unfortunately the, app approval people are the worst ever to do business with. Uh, the person that we used to work with is on maternity leave. Carol is in, fantastic. Uh, so yeah, we've been a little bit frustrated trying to get, get our technology ready. So thanks to Gina for helping us out with uh, with uh, processing through PayPal for us today. Uh, so we, just to remind you guys, you're going to get full access to the library, the WordPress business, the PLR business, the, the mindset program, um, Let's Make Money DVD, unlimited hosting, two home study courses, my entire investment of the library, plus future products. And we're, oh boy, if I can just show you what I've added for this new deal that I've done. I can't, well, I'm going to talk, I haven't even, I don't even know about it, Mark. So you're going to have to, you're going to have to talk. I've got it's something. brand new. I have something I've to, got, to I've, talk I've, to you about that. Yeah, yeah. I've just, I've just added 50 products that are worth over a thousand dollars each. And wow. I've, I've just added like 5,000 products that are worth over $200 each for these guys. And it's just oh, absolutely gosh. incredible. I'm, I'm not, never, ever, 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 ever going to be offering this product at this price ever again because I'm going to be in big shit. Sorry, I shouldn't swear. Yeah. I'm going to be in big trouble. I'm going to be in big trouble with the guys that I'm doing this deal with. So this is the last time. So if you guys are ever interested in the library, now is the time because it's absolutely not going to happen again. 
So here again, I've got another slide. Join now, get your mystery bonus. Uh, for those that see the opportunity, maybe this can take action. Now here, this is very important as well. Get, you know, if you're not sure, please, 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 secure it now, because you've got 100% money back guarantee. Can we vouch for that? Um, subject to obviously you working with me honestly, I, and I say that for a reason because I've I've had a little bit of a nasty accident three, four years ago when I first started this, a few months after I joined, when somebody went in, pretty much ripped off my entire content and came back, said it was crap, can I have my money back? And I realized when I went to the back end that, wait a minute, I've just given this guy his money back and he's downloaded like, in those days I think I had about 40 or 50,000 products and he'd, he'd, he'd taken all of them. <laughs> so, um, I, you know, I put that there. Uh, I'll give you your money back if you work with me, you know, honestly. If it's not for you, you know, honestly, it's fine. It's just not a problem at all. You've got a third day full money back guarantee. Yeah, yeah. Don't, um, don't, don't sign up and, and rip, rip everything off and like, you know, no, it's, it's not, not right. It's in thirty days you bail. That's kind of, <laughs> that's kind of scammy. Uh, and, and, and by the way, we do keep track of that. <laughs> so we do, we do ban, we do ban people that take advantage. Um, but you, you know, you guys are my people, so you know, I'm not concerned with that. Um, so let's see. So Greg, Greg is in. Carol saying. Um, yeah, you'll pay ten dollars a month, Carol, and that's on that's it, that's at Mark's site. So, um, and that goes directly to him to, to handle all, making sure the technology works smoothly for you. Sam says Mark is absolutely right. I got a much higher price on the Genie Dream product library. The library is enormous. Yeah, and it and it is. I mean, it's it is it's really huge. Well done. Thank you for that. Uh, appreciate that that, uh, that feedback. Okay, now shall we shall we shall we close or shall we let people sign up? You know what? I think let's do what we did last time. Um, okay. And last time, I've, you know, I, I mentioned what the bonus was um, before I closed. And I think the reason was because I think we had a technical glitch. Um, but it actually worked out well because what happened was um, because I announced the bonus without closing, I think we had another 30 people <laughs> go rush <laughs> after I disclosed what the bonus was. <laughs> so those that haven't <laughs> signed up yet watch this because you're about to run in a minute now when I tell you this now do you remember I talked about the membership e-store now I'm going to give you guys completely free a complete e-store right this is going to be turnkey done for you good to go ready for you to start your own world's largest niche e-store right now and I'll tell you how that works you can go into my library and download, I don't know, for example, say health, nutrition, and diet products. Download, I would say download about 500 of them, okay? Because I don't know of any website out there that has 500 health, nutrition, and diet products. I, I, I don't know one that's out there, okay? So download those products, use this e-store, put these products on the e-store, and now instantly you've got the world's largest health nutrition and diet membership site and charge start to starting start charging people um, I don't know say forty seven dollars to sign up or ninety seven dollars to sign up and then I don't know five dollars a month ten dollars a month and crikey you know you're absolutely going to start making money day one now, if you make in the first month I don't know, say you get five people sign up, that's 500 bucks, that's another 50 bucks a month. Spend all of that money and, and, and buy more product or come into my library and download more. You know, there's just so many different ways you can do it. Start adding live workshops, live seminars, webinars. You know, and before you know it, guys, you're, you're making thousands of dollars a month. I know I make it sound easy, but you know, obviously there's, there's, there's work to be done, but it is absolutely possible. So you are going to get, those that are signing up today are going to get a mega mystery gift for action takers, complete e-store, turnkey, done for you, good to go. Ah, you know what? Guess what? You're going to get the e-store with resale rights. Ha <laughs> ha! So you can sell that e-store for what? a thousand bucks. You're doing what? Yes. <laughs> I didn't know. Yeah. We could. Wow. E-store with resale rights. So I'm going to let you, I'm going to give you a license to be able to resell that store. So if you sell one e-store, you've got a thousand bucks. If you want to 
have two e-stores for yourself or five e-stores for yourself, you can use them multiple times. I'm going to give you a multiple user license and a resale license. So what is that worth? Crikey. I mean, you know, if you haven't seen the value in this now, then I think you've wasted your time being on this webinar. And honestly, I'm not, I'm not being rude. I'm being absolutely <laughs> factual here right now. If, if you haven't signed up yet, um, please don't go on any more webinars. <laughs> because you're absolutely no, I mean, I mean this, I mean this because you just do not see value, you're not serious. If you've come just for the content and to milk the system, it's not really right, you know. Um, I'm pleased some people do, but you know, if it's a ten thousand dollar product and 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 you don't go for it, you know, I can understand, but if you guys really cannot see the value, I'm going to scratch my head and be very, very puzzled. Um, and the other reason I'll do that is because with Ken, you know, we have had way north of 75% every single time of people signing up. So, you know, it, it's a no-brainer. Uh, we do this deal to look after our people. They love it. They enjoy it. It's great product. It's great value. They make money from it. They come back time and time again. And I'm going to stop talking. <laughs> Two o'clock in the morning in the UK. And, uh, I'm just well, going to say my brothers and my sisters. Um, well, well, well hey, we, we, wait, 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 wait. We have a couple of questions, kiddo. You can't go anywhere yet. And, no, no, and, just, just thank you for the, for the oh, webinar. I'm still here. Uh, oh, okay, cool. Right. I thought you were, th thought you were the end of the end of the presentation. Thought thank you, you thought you were going away. No, I listen. I'm no, on. No, I'm, come on. I'm, when, when do I, when do I get away this life? Well, that's what I was like. You know, whatever. Um, <laughs> so, uh, okay, so. You guys, um, welcome. Serena says she's processing now. Uh, there are a couple of questions that are that are through. I want to make sure I get them. So if if I haven't gotten the questions, just pop them back back in the, back in the chat if you would. Um, so welcome aboard, Serena. Good to see you. Okay. So um, and I want to reiterate: when you guys join tonight, we will of course get the full the full list of people from from Gina as well uh, because it's coming through. Uh, should be coming through her cart, as I said. So. We will email you on, from my end and give you an invitation to our, our upcoming strategic implementation session. The agenda that we will have for the next one uh, will be related to PLR and how we use PLR. So um, that will be part of our agenda. So if you have questions once you start implementing it, be, I'll be delighted to answer them and help you implement them. That's why we have strategic implementation sessions for that reason. Um, it, PLR is, my God, it is, it is so the easy button and the key uh, Serena says PayPal is looping. I'm not quite sure what you mean by that. Where is it looping, looping back to? Um, I don't know. Um, anyway, let me let me start getting some of the questions answered, um, and also remind you that you will want to do some of your own customization. You want to you want to make some of these some of some of these products your own, and you can easily by reformatting by re definitely renaming. Um, so let me let me just start getting to some of the questions. How to avoid everyone who bought your products and promote the same or similar PLR? Okay. So if I understand the question correctly, and I, and, I, and I only see the initial D, so I don't know who the, who the whole D is, uh, but the key, the key to individuality of your PLR is to rename it and to add some content to it so that that way it's, it's for example, what, um, um, uh, what somebody did was, was Nadine did, excuse me, uh, she go, went ahead and did a compilation of three products into one book. So she created something new. You can do, you can turn something into video. I rename everything and I have my, my art department go ahead and, and give me a whole new image that, that fits our style. Okay. Now you can do that at Fiverr for $5, right? So you don't need a whole new, or you don't need a whole URL for it. I'll advise against that. And we'll talk more about that when you join us in two weeks or a week and a half. Okay. So, um, Okay, PayPal is not finalizing the purchase. I'm not sure. Is that on? Is that on, G, on the Genie Dream site, um, uh, Serena? Okay. Does Amazon allow Kindle eBooks or online PLR? No. Good question, D. Amazon Kindle does not allow straight PLR. However, if it's PLR that you have redone in your own name, and I shouldn't say your own name, in your in your own likeness, if you've edited it and and customized it, that's a different story. But straight PLR. No, because they don't want they don't want duplicated content. Okay, so they're not real happy about that. Nadine says she's got experts to contribute to the book and added content that way. Absolutely. So, and it's a great way to do it. 
Nadine's doing a hell of a good job for what she's building for herself. I mean, she, I mean I'm, she, I'm really impressed with what she's been able to put together. So you'll want to do the same kind of thing and customize. Okay, that's the way you're going to really make it sing. For me, PLR is the beginning of the relationship with your customer. So just taking it and posting it out. Some Now, Mark's got some things in there. So he's got some great meditation stuff that I would leave alone. Okay, that I would completely leave alone. But for but for you, um, you know, on on stuff that's that's uh, how do I say, uh, ebooks and stuff like that, it's easy for you to customize. Um, okay, Greg says he's having issues with the with this registra registration registration page at Genie Dream. Carol says she had two two attempts on on, on PayPal, but you got through on Genie Dream. Carol, I want to make sure. Um, okay, Genie Dream should be actually doing fine. Okay, was, was it Genie Dream? I'm, I'm getting on? I'm getting I'm, I'm getting confirmations from people signing up. Okay, great. Um, can your training course webinars are in the morning and during the consignment? I'm not able to join normally. Are there any other place? Yeah, the, the reason why I do the do the morning during the week in Sydney is because it covers the evening for the U.S. So I mean, I, I picked like 7 p.m. like this time right now that we did ours was the the best way I could I could manage covering both Sydney as well as New York, um, and and not do something like in the middle like three o'clock in the morning for me because there's no way I'm doing webinars at three in the morning anywhere. It destroys my body. Um, I'm, I'm, so, so that, that's how we've been pretty much doing them. But, um, we, for the stuff that we do for content, for example, the strategic implementation sessions for our members, they are all recorded in the, and in the members area. So, um, we can talk to you about, about membership in the Institute, which gives you a lot of those benefits, uh, automatically to be able to have access to that. Um, so that's what we can do for you. Okay. Um, and Nadine just Skype me on that. Um, okay, this yeah, I saw this question earlier. Thanks for posting it again. Will there be financial or legal implica implications if I use someone else's photo and name who I think uh, he or she would be a better representative for a certain product? An example, an image could be a friend. Will that person have a claim for share of the profits? The answer is it all depends upon what you do. If you're using stock photos and you buy the you have the rights to stock photos, you can do anything you want because stock photos you're you're buying licensing to that. So a lot of people will use um, stock images and buy the, and buy those images, which you can do anything you want with. If you would have a friend or someone uh, of a, you know using an image of a friend, well then you you want to get permission from that friend to use their likeness as a favor. And if you want to give them a share of the profits, hey, that's fantastic. I wouldn't, um, but but you can. You know, I, I I I don't use friends for that anyway. I mean, I would use a stock photo if I was to use an, an image at all. Uh, I don't usually use a lot of pe people images relative to one of my products. Okay, for example, my credit product, which began totally as PLR, and then I I kenergized it. That's how that's my customization term. I kenergize things. Um, the our credit product began as private label. It was great private label rights to begin with, and I again I completely enhanced it because I've got a ton of experience in that area. There is no picture of of a person there, and and the author of that is Brian Douglas. I wanted to keep that separate from my Ken branding. Okay, Carol said she got through. So I hope that makes sense to you. Uh, Genie Dream, Klaus says Genie Dream is hanging a little bit. Uh, where can I buy stock photos from? Oh, get, uh, go for stock photos. Just Google. Uh, Google. Uh, I've got I've got loads of stock photos. Oh man, I've got. Do you I've have them there too? Okay, so just go hundred, through Genie Dream. Thousand stock photos. Okay, I haven't even noticed that. <clears> for stock I, photos online, go to the diamond section. And their stock photos go low. I've got okay, you know, I never even saw that. I never even, yeah. yeah. Nadine's saying I stock photos. They're expensive. Um, but uh, there's there's some free sites that you can find. But yeah, if it's in Genie Dream, hell, I haven't you, even. You can, you, can actually make, you can actually make a membership stock photo site from my site. That's how many I've got. <laughs> wow. Okay, cool. So Gail's saying I got a problem. It's not loading. Let, yeah, let me work with you and try and figure it out, Gail. I, I thought I got an email that's saying it went through, but obviously if it hasn't, then we got to sort it out. So we'll we'll figure it out. Um, give me stick your stick your number in there. And I think you and I did this once before, where I called you and we processed it manually, if I remember. So we'll handle it. Mike says Genie Dream has it all. So, uh, so and let me let me kind of give you a heads up on that because I didn't even know that those pictures were in there. But what that tells you is there's a lot of stuff in there. So you will spend some time looking through it. Okay. And Carol says, "Do you have the is asking? Do you have the diamond level?" Mark, you want to answer? Does she have the diamond level? Uh, the, I've now included the diamond three as a as a bonus. Yeah. So the answer is yes. 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 Sorry. Yes. 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 You do. 
this so, is, this is so, everything. so cool. How can you judge when you've done enough customizing in a PLR to pass scrutiny, whether for Nook, Kindle, or a number of others, especially if the originality requirements of each are different? The answer to that, D, is I don't know, to be honest with you. Does anybody have an answer to that? Um, I have not put any... I mean, I, I modify my stuff, and I've not put, posted anything that is anything but other, other than original uh, into into Kindle. So I don't, you know, as I tell people flat out, don't do PLR into Kindle, and that's what what my, my buddy Ty Cohen's been teaching, and I've been teaching for Ty and, and working with him for a long time. So we don't use we don't put PLR in, into Kindle. But what I would tell you is, you, obviously, you, you want to customize it so it's not original. I would say that if you're at least fifty percent different, you're not going to have a problem. <laughs> But Mark, do you have any suggestions on that? Sorry. Do you have any suggestions on, on how much to customize before you can put something into, into, into Kindle or Nook? How much to customize what's product from my library? Yeah, if we're going to take, take PLR from your library and put it onto Kindle, we're not, Kindle's not going to work with straight PLR. you got to customize. Any idea how much? Uh, yeah, I would say quite a lot. Don't, I, don't I just think, change. Uh, yeah, yeah. Don't, don't just yeah, change don't, the title. Don't, don't, don't just change. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no. I mean, the guys that have gone taking my stuff on, you know, Amazon or Kindle or, or other places like that, I would take about, I would say around at least five products and mix it up amongst those. Um, you know, I, I've created a lot of my own products, and I, I don't, I don't, I've, I've never just changed the title. You know, I will, I will look through the product, I will take out. A lot of it, which I don't like, don't agree with, I think is crap. Um, you know, get 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 rid of that. There's always a lot of value and a lot of stuff, a lot of facts that you can add to it, add back to it. And it, honestly, it's not really very difficult. You know, once you've got a skeleton in a shell to go on, mm. you can really very easily create an outstanding product in very very little time. Try and change as much as you can. Um, otherwise, you're just going to give yourself a very bad reputation. So don't yeah. just change the title and whack it. And yeah, it. you want es I, es I wouldn't recommend it. especially by the way, if you want if you want to create additional value for what you're selling. So, like I said, for example, with with my original credit product that I began, that was that was one of one of my first products. I took the guts of it. Um, I turned it into at first I made it into an ebook, and I and I added multiple multiple additional things to it, and I and I bundled it. And gave a lot of stuff as bonuses. I rewrote a lot of it because it wasn't my language. When I say rewrote, I mean I, the, the content was was fine, but it didn't have my um, my my uh, personality in it. I'll, I'll, I'll say it that way. So it didn't have my voice. That's the word authors use. So I just I I put my voice in it, and now it's a completely new product. The content is the same. I shouldn't say the con I've added more content, but the basic content would be the same. Okay, for what you're doing, but the words are different, and the sentences are a little bit different. The structures are a bit different, so that it really is you, and then it's a different product. Okay, um, so that would be what I would recommend, and we'll go into more detail on that uh, a week from Monday. So uh, we'll we'll talk more about that and get more specific. Okay, because that's what I want you to be able to do as you implement. Um, Serena's having trouble getting into subscribe at Genie Dream. Um, it's not accessing for her. So FYI, Mark, we'll need to take care of Serena directly on that. She's one of she's one of my Trailblazer members. She's she gets. You know, I, I tell I tell you what, we've had we've had uh, about two or three people that have just said that. What I'd like you to do, yeah. those that have paid the two ninety seven, yeah, um, and for some reason they they're having difficulty in signing up to the Genie Dream. If you can just let me have uh, their email IDs, I will I will get Martin when he wakes up in the morning because it's two thirty in the morning right now. Okay. Yeah, she's saying True. payment payment accepted, but not connected. Yeah, we'll get you we'll get you guys sorted out. If there's if there's any issues that you guys have at all, what I want you to do just so that we can we can be, I don't want to say if so we can be in control of the situation. Just send me send us a support at totalpreneur dot com an email. Let me know that you that you're having trouble getting just, through. Yeah, just. Okay, then that can just record across the that, 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 yeah, that way Rose will track it and Rose goes straight to Mark. So that way it'll, it'll make it a lot easier. I want to make sure that you guys are, 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 are totally taken care of, okay? So that's going to be important. Lori is in. Welcome. Thank you. Let me go up because I want to make sure. Uh, Carol says, great idea combining two or three. Yeah, absolutely. See, I mean, 90% of people are getting in. I think what's probably happening is if two people are signing up exactly at the same time, it's probably kicking one out. Then I would, I would just, just, just try again. Yeah, or, I, or, or Ken, mm -hmm. you know what you could do? Those that have paid and that not been able to get in, just send them the link to my my subscription page. 
okay. we obviously only 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 give those that have paid that link otherwise. <laughs> well, yeah, well, that's the same link that we that we have them going to afterwards. I'll I'll, I'll 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 tell you what you and I'll talk about that offline so that we don't waste people's time Fine. and we'll we'll okay. come up with we'll come up with a solution. Yeah, awesome. okay. okay, so cool. Um, okay, so Nadine, you're gonna Skype me on that thing, and let's see. Um, okay, that was good. Ryan Ryan says just need to vary a little and throw in some little twists if they want to stand out. They should create new graphics. Yeah, I always create new graphics. First of all, I usually don't like the graphics that most people put together. They're not my style. So I rarely will use anyone else's graphics. Furthermore, because it's private label, it's you know you don't create your own your own personality if you use someone else's graphics. It's just you just don't, and you don't these days. You don't need to spend a lot of money to do it. So everything we do, we rebrand. And I'll tell you again, don't create as I did. Don't create a new website for every single one of your products. I want everything on one site. We'll go into that in more detail when I see you in two weeks. But that's really important uh, that you that you keep things on one site. Because that way your traffic is 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 more beneficial with Google. So that's what you want to do. Um, welcome aboard, Lori. Okay, Nadine says I um, I bought I wrote, I just wrote a four hundred page book showing people how to do this. See the universe took care of me. I'm so glad I wrote, <laughs> so glad you read the, read the resistance book I told you about. That's great. I'm still waiting for that testimonial, Nadine. By the way, um, I need to listen to the webinar. Okay, no problem, Jane. We'll get you a link on that. Adrian says re receive confirmation. What do I do next? Okay, so the next thing that you do, if you if you've gotten the, the two ninety seven through Adrian, then you you got to go into Genie Dream, and get your subscription for ten dollars a month set up, and then you're then you're actually into the uh, into the library. There was a question about about hosting. Where did that hosting question go? Uh, for your e store, do we need to pay fees uh, pay for hosting fees? I think I saw something on your slide about that, Mark. Hosting, they'll get completely free for the first year. Yep, unlimited. unlimited. Yep, your hosting's free for the first so year. If they want to, if they if they want to put the e-store and they want to use two megs or five megs or ten megs or one gig or two gig or ten gig or twenty gig or fifty gig or hundred gig, it doesn't matter. Okay. How much content they have. Okay. For the uh, first year, they can have it completely free. That's worth up to a couple of thousand bucks. Yeah, it's a great, it's a great course, and I keep I keep making notes every time we we do this webinar. I make a note to to do a course on. Uh, on master key system, which I, which I bought years ago, um, and this time I may actually do it because I really should be doing it. Uh, there's a there's a there's a note from DH. DH needs to, to be able to get access to to master key system. So, if you can help help him or her, I can't tell. Uh, okay, once once it. once you become a member, go to the bonus section, and in the bonus section, I think one of the first products is the master key. You can download the whole lot. Okay, take take a look and see if you can find that. If not, again, I want you to email. Put, send something in to support a total promoter. Oh, it's very clear, uh, Ken. Once they, once they log on, they'll see the bonus section. It's very, okay. very, it's very clear. They okay. Straight away. If, um, if, I can actually perhaps go online right now. Okay. If you, you want to show, if you want to show more of those, that would be great because he hasn't been able to get through, and apparently my support people weren't able to help. So I want to make sure that we get that sorted out. Okay. Uh, um, Gail finally loaded and gave me the secure payment page. So 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 Gail says she's cool. Oh, great, fantastic, Gail. Gail, fantastic. Okay, oh. great. I don't. Yeah, it's probably probably two people signing up at the same okay. time. Okay. Yeah. Two some. People. Okay. Some of you are putting your emails in here. Um, can we promote your bonus products? I mean, can we promote your bonus products and offer part of them to people for free as a bait? The bonus pro the bonus you're getting private label rights to to the bonuses, right? The bonuses are PLR, aren't they? No, that's a good question. Let me, let, let me let me let me answer that now. If the product comes with a license that says you cannot give it away free, then you cannot. Because some products, some authors like Mike for Sames product, for example, comes with a license that says that you're not going to give this product away free. It has to have, I think, his product is a minimum four hundred ninety-seven or two hundred ninety-seven dollar value because he doesn't want his product to be chucked around for nothing. Um, now, that's sort of theory. In practice, unfortunately, a um, few people do ignore the license. I'm not a police of it. I cannot police it. And there is really no police for it. Um, it's, just, it's just having integrity, being ethical, and doing what the license says. Um, if you want to ignore what the license says and do as you please, then then you can. But yeah, yeah. I, I wouldn't. Yeah, I would follow. My I mean, terms I, and, my terms and conditions clearly say. 
yeah, be be yeah. fair. Be fair to yeah, people. Don't do that. Don't be, do be, this. Yeah, be be fair to people. That's 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 what I would I would tell you guys to do, is is just do, do business with integrity and, and and see what the license says. Some of them you can, some of them you can't. Um, you know, some some of them have 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 uh, private label rights. So you can completely customize. Some of them have yeah, resale they, rights. They, yeah, you, so. you can keep the money for it anyway. So. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you, if, you, if, you, if you want to give away a product, I mean, I've got tons of product that's a free license. PLR, all PLR stuff is free license. You can do what the hell you like with PLR. You can give it away, you can change it, you can copyright, you can copy and paste it, you can put your own label on it. You can... PLR is free for all. With a PLR, you can really pretty much ignore whatever the license says because it's private label rights. You can, you can honestly do what you like with PLR. If there is a license with it, you can actually rip it up and chuck it in the bin. It doesn't mean anything. With PLR, it's do what you like. Cool. Okay. So let, let me see. Um, yeah, Serena, I just sent, sent you a message back. Just forward me an email on that so I can I can track it. And if I had to send it to Mark, I can send it to Mark. Um, can you can we use your bonus products to build a business membership site around it and still respect the author's right? The rights will be listed in there as to whether you can add to a membership site. And I mean, in some cases... I've seen rights where you can't give it away, but it can be part of a paid membership site. Okay, so it, just just read the detail; it'll it'll be all in there. Usually, if you have if it's part of a paid membership, you're cool. But again, just read what it says because everything is a little bit different. Um, okay, uh, so hey, Carol. So Carol, did we have an appointment the other day? Was that you? Because I didn't see you. I, I, your email is really familiar. I don't see too many Teslas. Us emails. Um, so let's see. With PLR, can I ignore the license? So with PLR, I can ignore the license. It's not, it's not that you're the license. You always want to look at the license, Nadine. But if you have private, if you have both. No, no, no. With, with PLR, well, honestly, uh, sorry, uh, sorry to interrupt you. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, with with PLR, you know you can because whatever the license says, it doesn't really matter because you see, with private label rights, you'll find hardly any will have a license anyway. Purely because of the nature of the product, it's private label right? You can do what you like to do. If, for any reason, you get one that has a license, uh, the author's just put that there really to try his luck, and try and he's, he's trying to have his cake and eat it. He's giving you PLR, but he's saying, well, you can do this, but you can't do this. The very fact of the nature of PLR is, you know what, you can actually do whatever you like with it. So then you really can ignore the license because otherwise it defeats the object of it being PLR. Then it's not a PLR. Uh, PLR is a private label. You can you can put your name on it, and once you've put your name on it, it's your product. Then it doesn't matter what the license says. You can actually do what you like with it. So, yeah. In, in answer to your question, with PLR, yes, you can ignore the license. Cool. Okay. Let's see. Um, D, D Riches. I love that D Riches. Can we choose uh, other to host eStore later on if we choose to? So, can you move the hosting of the eStore? Yes. Yes, yes, yes. After one year, if I'm going to charge you seventy-five thousand million dollars for a month and you want to move somewhere else, yeah, you can. But if you want to stay on my hosting, I mean, I've I've got at the moment like oh, I don't know how many hundreds of customers. Um, once I quote them the price for the following year, they look around, they can't find anything cheaper, and they stay. I've not lost money yet. <laughs> so I'll cool. be cheaper than anything else you can find yeah. after a year. Anyway, so yeah, I mean, but it, you can it, move if, if you want to. Yeah. You oh, cool. Move. Okay, I didn't realize you could do that. I thought that. Because it, there was so much in it that you you know that you couldn't do that. No, okay. no, no, wow. it's very, okay. very, very easy. To make. Oh, cool. Very okay. Easy. Okay. Um, fantastic. Anybody? Well, I've, so I've got I've, I've got <clears throat> I've got a spreadsheet of your email addresses here. So I have to pull those. I to go to webinar and and go through that. So we'll give we'll give Mark the um, everyone's emails just to make sure because it seems like most people are having trouble with Genie Dream right now. Um, and and what what we'll do is uh, your questions on hosting. Since you got a year free, you don't. You probably don't need to need okay. to be worrying about that right now. Um, so I'll let you. I'll let you deal with that straight with Mark on that because that's that's not you. You don't need to worry about it for a year. You're covered. Um, any other questions, ladies and gentlemen? Okay. Yeah, I'm getting. So everyone's popping in email addresses. So so I'm. I'll get those to you, Mark, and you can send them over to um, uh, to your guy to to track it out. Oh, it's my, it's my pleasure. Yeah, Nadine, Nadine, Nadine says that, you know, some PLR says for private use only cannot be given away. You know, you, you can, Nadine, um, you know, you can, you can win an argument by saying, well, look, if it's private labor rights, which means you can put your name on the product and it's your product now, 
then nobody can stop you doing whatever you want with your own product because now it's your product. So they do try it. They do say, well, this PLR is this and this PLR is that. And, you know, I, I, I don't know. I mean, if it went to court, if it, if it did go all the way there, and I, I've never heard of a, ever a case of going there, but I, I think any judge would rule in your favor. Like, look, you've sold a private labor rights product. You've, basically, you've, you've sold the person the rights to do whatever they like with it, and you cannot then start restricting. So uh, you'd, 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 you'd have a very good argument. So I, I, I wouldn't really worry. But if it's bothering you, then, then you know, do as the license says. But you know, with resale rights, it's, it's quite strict. It's quite clear. You know, please obey what the ESC says, because they are just it's just to resell it, and you've got to resell it on the terms that it says. But you know, if I, if I give you something and I say to you, Nadine, you can put your own name on it, but then don't do this and don't do that. Mm, I don't know. I, I don't know. I don't think a case has ever gone to court, so I've got nothing nothing to go on. But I'm just being logical about it. That you, you, you see, PLR products generally go for a lot more money than resale rights. And the reason is because of that, that you can do what you like with it. But then you can't then charge a lot of money and give PLR and then start restricting it because then it's a resale rights product. But that's, that's, that's my logic and my argument. But there you go. I don't know who's right, who's wrong. <laughs> <laughs> no problem. Any other questions, you guys? Speak now. And, and by the way, as I said, uh, the, you will all take, be look at this guy, Tony. Tony, sorry to interrupt you. Can I do apologize, but I just had to read this. Tony, Tony said it's taken me 25 minutes, and I'm finally into GDP. Oh my gosh! Very slow to, oh, it's running very slow to load. No, 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 no. That you know what? Check your local connection. I'll tell you. Uh, let me let me just give you a couple of minutes on this. Our servers are at Telecity Telehouse, which is basically like British Telecom, and we've got the biggest, largest bandwidth and the highest processing power. Uh, using our website is, is almost like using Facebook, pretty much. They are extremely powerful, high process servers, and they're in a <coughs> bandwidth at Telehouse and Telecity. If you have trouble accessing our servers, I'd be very surprised. I would actually look at your local, your local connection. Um, if it does continue, if it does persist, let me know. But we've never had that problem. Our servers are very, very quick. And even if they go through 30 hops into Argentina or somewhere like that, they're, they're still. They're hey, still, hey, they're Mark, still it's, yes. it's, it's, um, look at the chat. It's not just them. It's Gail's having the same problem. Now, Klaus is saying his local's working fine. So the, we, we, need, we need to look at that. Um, let's see. There was, uh, let's see, Nancy. Nancy, um, and you're uh, you're unable to get in. Is that Genie Dream or is that the actual 297 What's product? That PayPal? Is that PayPal? All right, then Nancy, give me give, let me know where you're at. Give me your contact information, or if you're on, if you're in the U.S., give me your phone number. If you're elsewhere, give me your Skype, and I'll I'll get with you as okay, soon I'm as just, it's over. I'm just gonna log on. I'm just gonna log on to Genie Dream myself. Greg can't even, can't even get into Genie Dream. Okay, so yeah, so Nancy, where where are you at? And I'll, I'll just I'll just contact you. Um, Okay, you see, I haven't had any problem getting into Genie Dream on my end, but you know that's me. So whatever. Uh, okay. Now I have. It says, "Oops, Google Chrome could not connect to Genie Dream." Hmm. Uh, okay. Yeah, I think I think they they could possibly they could possibly be. I'll put my hands up. There could possibly be an issue. It only happens when we do a webinar. With our <laughs> Nancy, I'll Nancy, I'll call you as soon as this is over, and I'll try and, and manually process it for you. Is that cool? Oh, I've got I've got a gentleman next to me saying if Google Chrome is struggling, try Explorer or Firefox. I think there's something wrong with Google Chrome right now. Are you guys all using Google Chrome? Is anyone using Explorer or Firefox? I don't know. Let me see. What can I find? Where's... Yeah, it's a Google Chrome. Program. Carol says World Play is slow, but going through. Uh, even trying to log in, um, it's a lot of timing out. Can somebody tell me? Can somebody tell me if they're using 
Florida. Okay. Gail got in on Firefox after <clears throat> after ten minutes. <clears throat> Tony's using Chrome. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm, I'm losing, and I'm losing my voice. There's, there's, a, there's, there's a problem with Chrome right now. It looks like. Let me, um, let, me, let, me let me just use uh, Explorer. Uh, uh, and regarding reputable writers with price to add contents to PLR, um, you can go to Odesk. A lot of people are going to Odesk, and you can you can look for a writer there, and there's inexpensive oh, writers. What's going on here? Wow, what happened there? Could you hear that, or was that just me? What? I heard some lots of music. Mike says Safari works fine. Yeah, it's it's Chrome. Um, I'm the same problem. Ser Ser Serena's having the same problem with Chrome. Yeah, it's Chrome. Okay, interesting. Well, uh, okay, so so you guys take try the link in Firefox or or Safari if you're on a Mac. Or, or just just wait, because Chrome when Chrome has a problem, they normally fix it within fifteen to twenty minutes. They guys they've got a whole um, army of people that are just yeah. on the case and yeah. they do fix their problems very, very, very fast. How does so, how does because it's like two thirty in the morning, if they do maintenance, they do it at this time. Because they don't expect many people to be using it at this time. Okay. Mind you, it's two thirty here, that's the sort of thing actually, because in America yeah. it's yeah. so yeah, so try so try a different browser. I guess that's that's this that's the one other potential solution. Um, yeah, Lori's saying it's a problem with Chrome uh, on, on her end. Chrome, um, the, Serena, if you're having a problem, just look at the link that's actually in your address bar. Because I can't put that I can't put that into. First of all, I don't know what what is off the top of my head anyway. It's all programmed into our in, in the payment system. But after you guys have bought, that link is automatic. So. Uh, you know, it takes you right right there. So just take the copy the address in your in your address bar, and go into go into Firefox or any other browser that you've got. Okay, that'll be the easiest way to handle that. And my apologies for that, but that's what makes life exciting. It's techie stuff. Mm, yeah. Well, at least okay. at least we had a. At least we have a trouble. Trouble. Yeah. Thing. Well, I've, well, I've got, I've, I've got a, I've got a long, a long spreadsheet of, of email addresses here that I'll get over to you, Mark. Um, and then you can, you can, you can just have your guy check them out. Right? I'm just going to send you the whole. But the no, whole... you know, you, you know what? Before, before you send me the email addresses, please just ask the people to, to check within a couple of hours. I think, I think it's a, it's a problem issue. And if there still is a problem, send it to me. Well, sort it out within, within no time. Okay. Do me, do me a favor, you guys. To, just to make life easier for all of us, uh, if you like, I said, if, as Mark's saying, if you can check, you know, in, in in a little bit, try it again. If you still can't get through, pop us a note in support because again, that way I can, it's all documented. And we have a case for it. That'll be a lot easier for for Rose to track. Okay, so that that'll be it'll be better it'll be better service for you, and that's support at totalpreneur dot com. And, and so, you, you you know what I'm going to do? Uh, I don't. I'm not going to take off. I'm I'm not going to take off the the page for the time being. So okay. people want to sign up a little bit later. Okay. All right. and, and Nancy, I'll call you as soon as we're off of this. So so we'll be good there. Okay. Anything else, you guys? Can I bid everybody farewell? You can bid everybody farewell. I will excuse you, young man. Uh, well, wait, wait. D. Riches has another last question. How much do we need to change on PLR? It's up to you. It's what your who your market is. We'll, we'll we'll talk more about that in you know a week from Monday. But what you change is entirely up to you. The PLR is world-class fantastic, then you'll change very little. If the PLR is, it, it doesn't have as much detail as you want, or you want to add more to it because you think it's incomplete, you may bundle things together. It's it, it's your it's your product. You have somebody that basically has done some of the writing for you, and what you're going to do is customize it to what serves you. So it's your answer. Carol says, thank you. It's both been great. Gail says, it's not taking me to another site to log in. Ay, ay, ay. Um, it should have, Gail, if you copied the link that's in the it's in your browser, it should it should take you back to Genie Dream the same way. It's because it's the same unless you've redirected after you it originally took you someplace. I don't know, um, but what I'll do is I, I'll see if I can track down all the buyers, get you guys that specific link, and get it email. It's gonna take us a while, and unfortunately, I've got I I must go to get my visa renewed, or they'll throw me out of the country this this morning. So I literally have to go to U.S. Embassy within the next hour. <laughs> so so. Um, so, uh, so I personally am not able to do this, handle this for, for a little bit. Uh, I'm on WorldPay yet with a confirmation. Oh, so that means you're good. You're just stuck in WorldPay because because that link, that WorldPay link, you've already passed the Genie Dream link. So that link, if you put it in another browser, is not going to not going to solve it for you. You got to use you got to use the Genie Dream link 
to be able to move to another browser. If you're real pay, I would imagine you're already past where you began. So we'll get you figured out. Um, just if it's not working, then um, just stick something in into support and we'll track it out. And we'll send you the actual link link. And, and Mark, I may do that anyway in a, in a confirmation email. Yeah, yeah, everybody. Do that, do that. That, so fine. that's what we'll do. Once I, once I accumulate well, those. Tomorrow, uh, tomorrow is a good Friday. I'm at home all day. So any issues, um, my, uh, I, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm in a Buddhist country. We don't celebrate that nor Christmas. So it's a, it's a work day for us here. Yeah, we have uh, oh, thanks, Gail. No, this is no problem. It's just, it's just getting it done. Um, so, um, okay, you guys, well, thank you. And thanks for, for your patience on that. Uh, Nancy, I'll call you in just a, just a minute to get you squared away so we get you on board. And um, within the next, I'll say within the next 12 hours, we'll have, I'll, I'll email you guys with that link just in case you needed it. And uh, hopefully by that time, Chrome will be sorted out. If not, use another browser, but we'll get you in. If anything else you need, just email Rose. She is the, the queen of support for us. And um, uh, we'll... Um, We'll take it from there, but we'll get you guys all sorted out. You'll be invited, by the way, as I said, you will be invited to a week from Tuesday's strategic implementation session. We run them at 7 o'clock USA Eastern time, which is going to be 10 a.m. Sydney time on Tuesday morning. Uh, it is Good Friday here in, I know, in Sydney, yes. I have training on Monday in Sydney, and I'm training on Monday in Sydney or, Sydney or the U.S. Training um, training is Monday, in, Monday, in, Monday night, 7 p.m. USA Eastern time, 10 a.m. Sydney time. Um, <laughs> Nadine wants my chocolate eggs. Okay. Um, and um, he's saying it's 9 a.m. Sydney. Well, whatever the time is, whatever whatever nine, 7 p.m. New York time is, I thought Sydney was three hours different from Bangkok. So, um, but I may be completely Tonight, confused. Guys. Anyway, can, can, I, can I, can I, Mark, and yeah, you're right. You're right. It's, it is 9 a.m. in Sydney. Forgive me. You guys, you guys, yeah, your, your, your daylight savings changed. And, and yeah. Okay. All right. Anything else, you guys, before I can go so I can call uh, Nancy and get uh, get everything sorted out? All right. So at cool. quarter to nine in the morning here in Bangkok, um, Mark, thank you again. And um, <laughs> It's a pleasure. All right. You and I need to talk about that new deal you're doing because I got something that's going to work for you. And uh, everybody else, thank you guys so much. Serena, I'll take care of your thing as well. And um, I love you guys. Thanks for coming with us today for, on this journey. It's uh, It's been wonderful. I will. Uh, I'll talk to you all soon. Good night, everybody. Bye, everybody. Bye-bye.